Hey, uh, folks, Quill18 here, and welcome, welcome, welcome to our Saturday live stream where I asked some people on Discord and people said, yeah, anything except cities. Apparently, apparently people are in the mood for a little change up. I just got a code uh, yesterday the day before for a game called Infection Free Zone. I haven't loaded it up yet. And then I did this morning and I was like, okay, yeah, I kind of want to play this bad boy. It's, it's, I think it's got some huge potential. I actually hadn't realized it was from the same people who made the uh, 911 operator and 112 operator game. Uh, played the 911 operator game ages ago. And I'm not sure they had the um, the real city functionality at the time. I don't know if I was still in an early access one or that came later with a patch, but clearly this game company loves to integrate real world mapping dynamically into their game. So we're gonna be playing a zombie survival game in my actual hometown. And then it's gonna give me an excuse to, you know, talk about the local landscape and landmarks and all those sorts of things. Is that if this game to be released eventually? Yeah. Um, I am playing a, like a sort of an exclusive press early alpha. Again, the game's not even in pre, uh, in, it's not even in early access yet. However, there is a prologue mode you can play. Now the prologue, I think just has six hard coded cities. It doesn't have the dynamic city aspect. Um, and I think it's only got something like eight days of gameplay. Although it's a, that's a pretty sizable chunk. The, uh, the prologue's got something like a 92% positive rate on Steam, which is pretty nice. But we're gonna be playing the, the full version, but again, it's it's not even in early access yet. So obviously there's gonna be a billion things missing, stuff might break, we'll give it a go, we'll give it a try and we'll see how far we get. And then maybe this is the whole stream, maybe we play for 45 minutes, then we get bored and we switch to something else. I don't know, who knows what's gonna to happen today? We'll see. Hoping for more Last Train Hope. I mean, that's a possibility. Uh, the other thing is on Discord, people brought up flight simulators and I'm very suggestible for things when it comes to playing flight simulators. So we might consider some of that as well. We'll see. Um, so yeah, this is, there. there's an ability. You can request something on the Steam page for the game. You can request um, to join the play test or whatever, which I suspect is basically what I've got here, but uh, they just sent me the code to get started. So we'll see zombies on the plane, yeah. Anything that happened Saturday, is that what we are? Maybe, maybe it is. Maybe it is. <gasps> Gift subs from the librarian. Also, a shoot out. Where's my proper page here? There was, um, hang on. There were some gift subs a minute ago as well. Uh, why is it not? Why is it log? Someone gifted a gift sub. Oh, I don't know why Streamlabs doesn't have it. Uh, I can probably find it somewhere. Actually, it's not listed anywhere in here, which is very frustrating. Someone gifted a a single gift sub, a singleton, and it's not showing up in the list. And it was like their 95th gift sub to the channel. Well, like my extreme apologies for not, hang on, can I scroll back enough in the chat? Silverfish! Silverfish gifted this up to Captain Trav. There we go. I had to scroll back far enough to see it. Oh, there you go. And Silverfish says, "Twas me. There you are. Uh, so that luckily it was still in it. I don't know why Streamlabs didn't have it properly in there. That's very disappointing. And also the librarian just now gifting some five gift subs to the channel. Thank you very much. If we can get a hype train going on, that's good. One of the issues with streaming a lesser known game is that people aren't, you know, there's probably no one surfing the... Uh, the Twitch category for Infection Free Zone, right? Where if we're playing City Skylines, there's probably people casually looking the category and then discovering the channel. So if we can get like a hype train going solidly, that is very good because that does tend to push the front page and get some more attention. We might get some uh, some people who aren't looking for the game to uh, to discover the channel and the game. Quickly, let's read the subs and resubs and then we're gonna get started. We got Finn McCool started us off today at 104 months. Juna followed up at 79 months. Says, let's get ready to zombie. It's in your head. It's in your... Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. JMS is at 16 months. Shuddy's at 61. Excel Miguel's at 51 months. Weird Darkness is at 55. Any chance to give the Sim Settlements 2 mod to go and follow up for? I have dabbled with it. Those Sim Settlement mods are excellent. Yeah, I actually started a Fallout 4 game just on my own a little while ago. It was fun to revisit it. I was playing in survival mode. Although survival mode with a tweak, a couple of things. Um because Fallout 4 is kind of unstable, I used a mod to re-enable uh, saving on zone transitions because um, you could go a long time between being able to save because you can only save in beds in survival mode and then the game crashes and you're like, yep, I'm never playing this game again. So adding that back in made a big difference. Um, 
Do, do, do. So we're at Darkness Temporal Trash at 50 months. Voxel Hounds at 43 months. Silent the Hunter is at 34 months. Overman is at a five year Twitch anniversary. Charlie Eliza is at 56 months. XJSC is at 45. Lazy Boots at 73 months. Code Brewers at 41. Tiny Dills at 34 months. Arrestress. Eurastis, sorry, is at 61 months. MGZ Shonix, 111. 111 months from Shonix. Norman the Dane is at 94 months. Wretched Medic is at 109. Perks is at 27. Rixit is at 109. We have lots of old timers in the channel today. Chris the Ward is at 10 months. Rhyme Pendragon is at 102. Cheyenne is a Twitch baby, a nine month Twitch baby at Cheyenne. Lady Stormguard is at 34 months. And just now we got Cool Man Nacho at 107 months and says, oh Quill, almost sub for nine years. Puns, what is zombie's favorite language? Latin, because it's a dead language. What do zombies consult to find their futures? Horror scopes. Nozoki's coming in at 108 months, and we've got a three-year Twitch anniversary from NCC Voyager. And then last Revenant coming in just now at 106 months. Thank you very much. All right, let's play some video games. Let's play some video games. Okay, so I dabbled with it for maybe like an hour this morning, um, and actually had a hard time pulling myself away from this to like start setting up the stream. So I've got, you know, just a little bit of familiarity with the user interface and things like that, but haven't really delved in too deeply into the game. But enough to know that like, yeah, I like it. So we're going to start a new game over here. And literally, you get to start in any city you want. Now, they've got some recommendations over here, which is quite cool. But the other thing you can do is, yeah, you can just zoom into any city and decide to start there. We are be playing in my hometown, my actual hometown of Sudbury. Um, incidentally, for those of you who have watched uh, Resident Evil Welcome to Raccoon City movie, Welcome to Raccoon City. This is where it was filmed. Uh, there are multiple locations in the movie that exist here, um, and we might be able to we might be able to visit some of it. So we'll see. But yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna be playing right over here. Uh, the zone name by default infection free zone. I think that's probably fine just to get into the vibe. We're gonna start in April, which is I mean I'm hoping that uh, oh we can't choose here. I suspect they're gonna have seasons and stuff like that. Probably like hot and cold weather, which is going to be a mechanic that's going to matter. We're going to leave all the difficulties on the default over here. There's more settings and things, but let's go ahead and start. Cyber equals Raccoon City. Exactly. I've never seen the movie either. I'm not really into the Resident Evil franchise specifically. I'm going to have to watch it at some point uh, just to see. But yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Boom. Cold weather zombies. And maybe it'll be you know, freeze in the winter. It's like that Simpsons episode where they, like, import the snakes and then the gorillas. Okay, we have to choose a headquarter in the city. Now, when uh, when I was doing my little test run, I actually started... Uh, where are we? Right over here, because... And actually, I won't say until we click on it, but this is, uh, this is our favorite Mexican restaurant in town. Uh, La Casa Mexicana, right over here. Really, really, really great food. Um, but I'm wondering, like, if I should start in one of the bigger buildings so we'd have a lot more storage capacity, a lot more living quarters, um, so we don't have to worry about expanding. It was fun to start in a little one. It's probably smarter to start in a big one, unless the big one, unless there's other, um, unless there are other problems to starting in a bigger site. I actually don't know, uh, what the balance is. Maybe there's extra difficulties from starting somewhere larger. This used to be, well, I mean, it sort of still is. This used to be, like, one of the primary malls in the city, but the downtown area, which is where we are here in my town, is kinda, has kinda died in a lot of ways. And there's lots of different reasons for it. Um, there are bigger malls and things. One of the big things is this is a, a city that is very driven <laughs> by, um, by car access. Um, everyone's got a car, everyone wants to use a car for everything because everything is spread out. Our public transit sort of sucks. So like downtown has no, no truly significant amount of parking, which means it's a pain enough to get there. So it's just one of these problems, right? That is very, that happens when you develop a car centric city. Everyone, you need a car. So everyone's got a car, which means the entire city gets designed for cars, which means everyone needs a car and you end up with this endless loop of like garbage. So the downtown core is kind of, kind of gone to pop. But when I was a teenager, it was a lot of fun. Spent a lot of time in some of the cafes and stuff in town. Anyway, this used to be a mall. Now it's been taken over by, well, this is a little bit inaccurate. Service Ontario with like the government of Ontario um, access thing is actually just the frontage over here. It's not the whole place, but yeah. So I don't know. We could do that. <laughs> downtown died. Sounds about right. Or I'm kind of tempted to just start over here again with like some small stuff. Medium-sized building and some good loot location. That might be an interesting thing too. Like, what if the bigger ones we want to save to loot afterwards? Maybe we could start. We could start right over here, or Service Canada. So this is the um, 
one of the federal buildings. This is where we go to like get our get our passport if we want to go in person. You can do it by mail, but you can do it here. Maybe I should just do this. I think I'm gonna just do this. Hey, Lord Amux, nice to see you. Nightmare on Elm Street. I mean, that's the thing too, right? We'll literally be starting on Elm Street and how perfect is that for sort of a horror theme sort of thing. So we'll start in Service Canada. We're gonna confirm this as our HQ and done. I'm gonna pause right away. Operator, this is first squad leader. I think I have to increase the volume. The neighborhood looks deserted. We'll have to scavenge the nearby buildings for any useful resources. How, how was the sound? Was it too low? I have it there, I have it there, I have it there. Hey, <laughs> some of these games, they do pan when you uh, move your mouse out of things. Money for Essentia, money for Essentia. Hey, cool man! Essentia. All the old timer is okay. all the zombies Find in this game. Also more zombie puns. Why do many zombies go to sleep early? They are dead tired. Who ah. do zombies avoid eating and why? Clowns, because they taste funny. What do you call a Mexican zombie? Zombre. Zombre! Oh yeah, maybe move the face just for the um, the conversations. Let me go and do something like that. Oh my God, it even pans when we're in the option menu. Okay, uh, we can hit the home key I found to send you to the headquarters. There's not a page exploiting um, shortcuts, which is unfortunate. I mean, good option so far. Again, it's early access. Um, Cause one of the things I'm interested in is if we can, if these squads can be hotkeyed. And as far as I can tell, they don't like, I kind of wish squad one was the one key so I could cycle between them very quickly. So we currently got 40 people. Four of them have been assigned to our first squad over here, squad right. one. We can rename this. Let's call this uh, the uh, the cool nacho squad. It's literally the last person who typed something in chat. So we're gonna do that. Has nothing to do with the bribe from, from uh, I was gonna say the chocolate whiskey fund, but now I guess it's money for Essentia fund. Um, has nothing to do with that. I just the first name I saw in chat. So that's gonna be the cool nacho squad over here. Um, oh yeah, we did have some hints. You can turn on the scavenge view with at V. There's a, a bunch of layers over here that are accessible. So labels, we can toggle on and on for the streets scavenge you to see if there's stuff inside. Um, UI unavailable right now, presumably, oh. No, apparently it is available currently. We can hide the UI, okay. And then full info doesn't seem right now to make a difference, unless it toggles the rest. Maybe that's what it's doing. No, I don't know what the full info view is doing, uh, but that's okay. Anyway, I think I'll leave the um, the scavenging markers on because that seems relatively useful for us. Um, we can actually make a new squad right away. We might go ahead and do that. I'm gonna make squad number two and I'm gonna just look at, uh, this is gonna be the sagacious anti-Z squad. There we go. And then these people all have names too. Mary, Kevin Smith, Roy Brooks, Michael Thompson. They have little stats going on as well, too. Well, these don't have any, but maybe it's because they haven't leveled up yet. Maybe they'll develop the skills as they do things. I wonder if squads making squads specialize in something makes some amount of sense. I wonder if that's a mechanic. I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, we've got these little things. So scavenge some things um, in nearby buildings. What we're going to do is we're just going to grab one of our squads. So the cool nacho squad. Tell you what, let's send it to the Service Ontario building over here where there is theoretically some canned food, scientific materials, and maybe some other resources that we can send over there. And then the Sagacious squad, Z Squad, we'll just send to one of the adjacent buildings. Um, you know, food early on is gonna be good. What we'll do is we'll look to strip just a bunch of the food from the nearby things. Maybe we'll go ahead and clear this building because we might wanna develop this into a warehouse or something later, and it's gonna be fairly sizable, so that's gonna be okay. Um, we have, we can set up some gathering things. There's a few just random trees over here. We'll set up a little area right over here to gather some wood. Um, maybe we'll gather some metal if there's any like crash cars or street lights. There we go. We'll do that. And then there's also a, a gather bricks. But when I was looking before, yeah, I don't think this is going to lead. I don't think there's any bricks in this area. Now we do have the sort of banish style, um, worker management screen over here where we can move things, people from one category to another. Um, for example, we still have some unemployed citizens. I can just go and throw some more people into the scavenge job for now. We're going to want to, uh, put them into building and things relatively soon, but for now we can have them kickstart of that. Unless I just make another military squad. I don't know if we've got enough weapons for more than that, but that might be a good idea. You know what? I'm going to pull back on four scavengers and what we're going to do instead, we're going to make a third squad. Yeah, only two of them have guns, so we weren't going to want to engage them in combat, but we'll do what we can. And apparently it's going to be Army Llama. There you go. Army Llama, just pulling names out of chat for the next squad here. So yeah, they're not armed, which is... Operator. 
I, see, I called it Arma, didn't I? But it's supposed to be Army. You know what? I'm going to change it a little bit more. I'm going to go Army O-Llamas. Because I love the idea of an army of llamas that we're going to make with. Uh, so we'll just... Uh, maybe we could send you down over here. The pills. And what I like is every single one of these buildings... Like, is the actual building names. Life Mark Physiotherapy over here. And they're like, oh, that seems like the sort of place that maybe she had a medicine. We've got the Michaud Medical Pharmacy over here. Again, another place for uh, for medicine, possibly. I mean, a lot of these buildings are sort of just generic. And they're like, well, there might be some food or something going on. Uh, Canadian Career College over here. Another place where we might find some uh, research material, for example. Uh, really, really quite cool. I love, I love seeing my city. Uh, there's a kind of a weird thing here where we've... Well, that's not what I meant. Zoom there. Zoom out here. Ooh. No, that's that's being especially weird. I don't know why it's doing that. Um, as I say, you can zoom out, and then it's sort of like... Um, it only zooms out so far. I'm going to try one more time here with none of the UI open. Oh, I don't know why it's doing that. That's a shame. I wasn't doing that earlier. I might just be able to save and quit for but that's going to be fine. Actually, speaking of, I'm going to go ahead and save our start here. There we go. All right, quads being deployed. We can keep an eye on them. See, there's a little movement icon over here. You are in a building currently doing some scavenging, so you're busy, which is great. We've got, you see all these little yellow, uh, green circles? These are our, the rest of our people in the building that are fanning out to start doing some scavenging or like they're, they're doing ones that are going to chop down some trees and whatever. And yeah, right now we're waiting for some scavenging to be finished. Definitely cannot be purchased. Anyway, what do you call zombie Sir, poop? Boo do. How do zombies like to travel? Trends. What do you call an underwater distillery? Suburban development. <laughs> uh, oh, we found a car. That's great. Who was that with these puns this time around? It was MJ. Thank you. Quill's integrity definitely cannot be purchased. Oh, uh, I, I am actually like notoriously corrupt, so we may have to use MJ's name for something. Uh, we found ourselves a car. Okay. Where was it? Over here. Excellent. Okay, we're gonna have to go and scavenge that soon so that we can bring it back. Hopefully it's got plenty of fuel. Yeah, we can use that to move faster for longer distances. Although right now we're just gonna focus on scavenging things that are nearby. So hopefully it's gonna be okay. I can increase the speed. We got some burbs going up above. Microphone's still in the way there. We might wanna move a little bit more. I mean, it does it does read it out, which is good. If I go no, this way, be a little, maybe a little bit more self-contained. We'll see. All right, so Army of Llamas is currently idle. Now, I do kind of, again, I kind of wish we could hotkey the um, uh, the units. And it might be possible, but I don't know what it is. I kept assuming it might be number one, but it's not. Um, so they've gone on scavenged Old City Hall. They do have some cans of food uh, that they haven't brought back yet. So we could send them back to the HQ. But I think what I'll do is I'll just send them to an adjacent building. They'll do that. Whenever they fill up on resources, then they bring it back to the HQ or the nearest warehouse. We modify the car into a zombie car. I don't know, but it does make me think we, like... Um, uh, oh my god. Like playing Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead or the the more visual roguelike zombie game that's very popular. That's developed by like basically one per what's it called? The isometric one. Oh my god! Someone in the chat on though. Project Zomboid, thank you. It's like, hmm, maybe we're going to a whole zombie vibe. I don't know. Yeah. There we go. Elizabeth Stewart over here is chopping down a uh, a light post for some metal. Take a look at our squads. Okay, everyone is still busy. Looking good. We've got, uh, what time are we? We're about noon over here. We haven't returned any research, but at some point it will be. Uh, the cool man, the cool nacho squad over here. Oh, it hasn't collected anything physical yet. Oop, another transmission. Sir, the crates are in the HQ. We have to think what to scavenge first. It will be best to check some shops or warehouses. Okie dokie. Okay, I'll point you where to go. Oh yeah, army of llamas is idle. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna send you over here because it might have food, might have some medicine. I will speak on behalf of the other citizens. Let us go and adapt the buildings to suitable shelters, so we won't spend a single more night underground. Okay. Um. Yes. So, uh, Gene asked if you block off multiple buildings with competent sorts. We got a building menu over here with different categories, so we can upgrade. We can take over some of these buildings and change them to things. We can build farming. We also over here. Yes, we can build walls. I haven't played with this yet, 
but theoretically we can cordon off certain areas. I know we will get a quest fairly early on to build one of these uh, towers where I think we can have a uh, an attack squad in a very elevated position and cover a lot of territory, which seems to like be useful. Um, adapt buildings and shelter for living quarters. We actually have tons of living quarters because of where we are. We can still advance this quest if we wanted to by just taking over one of the buildings and building some extra shelter in there. So we might consider doing that. I might just do one of the small buildings to hopefully that it can be done very quickly. We'll see. All right, all our squads are still busy, which is great. I mean, if I had more idle people at home, I could go and build more squads. Oh, building is clear, that's great. Um, let's go and get you to clear out this building right here. Because what we might do is convert these, because if we put a watchtower, say, right in this spot, we're going to be able to cover um, Elm Street and... What would this, is this Lisger? Yeah, Lisger Street over here. See, it, I love playing in my own town. That's crazy. Uh, so we should get good vision down both those areas. So we should be able to protect these buildings here from random zombie attacks. Uh, so I think that's gonna be my plan right now. Ooh, Army of Llamas is currently idle. Where are you currently positioned? Old city lane way down there. Okay, I'll tell you what, come back here and yeah, we'll grab these buildings. Another transmission. Sir, the sun is getting low. We don't know what's gonna happen during the night. I'm getting real low. Continue our scavenging operations in the dark, but that will be way more dangerous than waiting until sunrise. Hang on a sec. I guess I'll move my head even more. Oh, I'm in the wrong window for this. I guess we'll do that. I don't usually like being in the middle of the screen. Uh, yeah, everyone get back to the HQ. Back in the HQ. The workers will return home too. Unarmed civilians should not walk after dark. Yeah, so all of our scavengers and stuff like that, or anyone assigned to like building, they automatically come home at sunset, but we can also recall our squads. You can click on an individual squad and go, go to the HQ as well. This is gonna give them an opportunity to drop off all their resources at the same time. So yeah. Play Plague Inc. after this with the, uh, the zombie virus. Instead of saving people, we can go and kill them all. Well, if you play in Canada, is there any real fear of zombies? After all, they would be polite to bite you without... It would be impolite to bite you without permission. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay, you know what we're going to do? I'm going to just save and reload here because that visual bug on the zoom out is kind of a bit annoying. Let's do that. I probably... I probably should have reloaded as this is the same session that I was playing um, earlier today. There you go. Apparently the exit button doesn't work from inside the game. We'll just reload it. It goes really quick. Again, I'm playing a, uh, it, the game's not even out in early access yet. So we're going to expect bugs. We're going to expect all kinds of issues. <laughs> Equip button is bugged. You can never leave. Please don't go. The drones will miss you. Also, apparently the uh, the main menu screen doesn't um, doesn't follow the VSync settings, so it's like as it's loading up, it's like four thousand FPS. Like, okay, relax there, video card. No need to show off. I think that in game it does it does follow. I turn VSync on because it doesn't like with recording. You get like I'm only recording at like sixty FPS anyway, so may as well save some GPU. There we go. Nice. Okay. So now we can zoom out and see a little bit more. And I love this view. I mean, the whole game is played this way, right? Like, um, well, presumably there'll be one of the zombie hordes will show up over here. The combat is just, it just happens on the screen. They just shoot and that's it. Mm -hmm. We can see the, uh, the vision cones as well, which is nice. You know, I probably, okay, until we actually see the horde. Going there. Reporting. Going there. I'm gonna send our people out to these buildings because we can go and send them back real quick. Although I just noticed if the opening, if the entrance door is on this side, maybe I should have sent them. You go there. Waiting orders. Okay. Oh, it's really muffled. Found something suspicious. There's a large piece of dried meat here with a piece of rope around it. It's attached to a counterweight. It seems to be a trap to catch something. Maybe humans, maybe some animals, or maybe even the infected. Somebody must have set up not so long ago. Are you there? Do we leave it or do we inspect it? Oh, let me pause the game here. What do we think? Must touch all the things, says MJ. All right. 
inspect it, make sure it's disarmed, then go. And we might not get any zombies this first night. Oh, no, there's a horde. Sir, we just saw a group of infected. They might not be aware of our presence yet. All right, now we're going to hide. What I'm going to do is there's a convenient little on the push to talk here. All squads return. We're going to get them home. There are some infected around here. They might not come here yet. We'll see. Fast forward, 11 p.m. Nope. Okay, the horde went a different direction. That's good. They will get more and more, you know, hordy as we keep going here. Okay. I'm pretty sure I got actually attacked the first night when I was playing earlier, so this is actually very nice. Okay, sun's almost up, so I'm going to go ahead and deploy my people again here. Yeah, let's go and clear all that. And then any minute now, we'll see everyone, all the civilians leaving here. Just start doing their, uh, there you go. See all the little green circles? So they're going out and scavenging some more. Okay, so we do have the mission to, actually, we don't have the mission for living quarters. I guess because we have enough. So just pass by. Reminds me of GTA 2. Ooh. Yeah, these are the real street names. Yep. Actual real street names. And we're just playing in the downtown city core. Oh. Transmission received. This night was easy. Yeah, there are sure to be some infected around here. We should build some defenses before the next nightfall. Um, they're using um a different thing. It's not Google Maps. They're using um, is it Open Street View or something like that? A different service, but yeah, basically the same thing. Let's build the watchtower. So I actually didn't get one built in my little test run, but I'm guessing these this wooden tower is going to be the way to go. And we can see like the vision cones. So yeah, I'm going to put it right here. Building clear. Boom! Right there. Now, we don't have any idle workers at the moment, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to go and pull back five scavengers and then assign some builders instead, and they should go out over here. They need some wood. We've collected a little bit of wood, so it should be fine. We'll do that. Meanwhile, our squads... Oh, they're all idle. Okay, we're going to send a squad the long, long way over here to go and claim this car. Cool man, Nacho squad. I hope you got your driver's license, Nacho. And then the rest... You know what? We're going to send a squad over here because we know there's some info available. And army of llamas. I guess we'll just keep strip mining this area for food. Okay. All along the watchtower. Oh, so many good covers that song as well. Yeah, the cool man squad's going to take a big hike out here to claim this car. We got apartment buildings. Um, there are a couple of schools as well. What's nice looking at? Right over here. There you go. Uh, huh. School Levi Street. Is this? I'm actually not sure. I think this is not the name. I think this is where I went to high school. I'm not sure. <laughs> bit late, but hey. Oh, hey, Internet Dragons. What does question mark stand for? We don't know what's in those places. Unknown. Maybe because it's a little further away, you know. Ooh, findable research. This looks like a car. Fascinating. All right, squads are still busy, which is great. Again, I'd love, I'd, like, I've tried tab. Like, I thought if, if it would be really nice to be able to cycle through our squads really quickly and see the state of things. So hopefully that's something that'll uh, come up. Or, again, maybe they already have hotkeys, but nothing that I can tell for the moment. Building clear. All right, building clear. They're returning home. There are signs of smoke. It's coming out of a building. I think there might be some people there. I recommend we go and investigate. Okay. Well, the fastest to do that might be with the squad in the car. Let's send that squad over here. There you go. Yeah, you can see they drive. They move much faster. Oh, uh, yeah, investigate. Let's investigate. There you go. Car was full of fuel. Good condition to start off with as well. This will help speed up our scavenging. And we can run over the infected if they get too close. Well, we're gonna see. Alright, how's everyone? Army of Llamas is currently idle. 
Oh, I think they money just return home with a bunch of stuff. Money for Essentia. Money for Essentia. And zombie apocalypse is a good time to learn to drive in car, since I don't have a driver license. <laughs> there you go. At least there's not going to be any police to pull you over. Not cool, man. Found some survivors. Living in terrible conditions for the last few years. We could bring them in, but will we be able to feed them? Yeah, we're going to accept the survivors. Of course we are. So I guess this is the squad of survivors going home. Uh, there's enough time they'll be able to get there before the zombies show up. Let's, since we're in the neighborhood and we've got a car, let's check out some of these question mark buildings. You know, and see what the deal is. Roger. Construction we're running out of resources. Out of pistol. Oh. Oh, we need weapons to equip this. What we're probably going to have to do is disband one of our squads to do that. And yeah, we got to keep checking this building. I forgot that we hadn't finished that. It is a big building, so I think it takes a long time to uh, process. All right, everyone's busy. Llamas are moving, but they're going there. Yep. Okay, good. And yeah, we can shift queue things, which might be useful for a lot of these small buildings. Yeah, don't forget about ammo. Yeah, that's the other thing too, right? If we look at a squad, what'll happen is when they start fighting, the green bar here will start to shrink as they use up their ammo. So Army of Llamas only has two pistols anyway. So we might, they might be the good contender to, um, to uh, stand down. Because we wouldn't really, we wouldn't really wouldn't want them fighting regardless. Well, I guess can we select bow and arrows? Does not require ammo. Here, I guess if we just do this, I mean that's not going to be as effective. But at least they're going to have something to shoot for now. In the U.S., are there more weapons available? <laughs> okay, Sagacious so Zed. So they're going to be on their way home because they're bringing a lot. They're full of canned food, so they're coming back. Clear. Sports store for hunting gear. Yeah, may, I mean maybe starting downtown here it's poor, um, because I don't know if there's not any. Uh, ooh, India, Little India would do good food. Um, there's not going to be any hardware stores anywhere around here. I bet you the uh, bookmark cities were chosen to be because, like, the spots they, they took were particularly interesting and well-balanced. Oh, the Cool Man Nacho Squad is not currently moving. They, they do tell you when they're done, but I don't know if they tell you quickly enough. I'm gonna check out over here. It looks like they got a car. I don't know if we can get another vehicle from that site. Very curious. Oh, uh, yeah, car does have increased capacity. It's got, um, it's got a bunch of, uh, it can hold up to ten different things, as opposed to just the four different things that the squads normally have. So yeah, much better. Well, there's an extra weapon in the car. Oh, I hadn't actually confirmed the trunk. There is. Um, now I know that it said you can drag weapons onto a squad. Oh, it is late. And yeah, you'll be fine. Um, but I don't know where you drag it from, or maybe we have to wait until it gets back home before that'll be considered. Okay, so Geisha said. Okay, you go home. Um, the Cool Man Squad is got the car, so hopefully they can get back fast enough. We're gonna try to let um, the Army Llamas here finish scouting this area, or I might be getting confused about who's who, but still. Can you show us where the Good Putsin restaurant is? Uh, the one on my treat stream? One on my treat stream, is it from, is it from Gloria's? Hang on, I don't remember. Where's my treat stream page? Uh, info. Bonga's Grill on OJ Street. I've actually never been there. Um, OJ Street, or Augur Street, is somewhere over here, is it not? Oh, hang on, pause. We got some Zs running around. Sir, it's almost nightfall. They can already see some I thought it was one of the these. But I'm not entirely sure. All right. No, no, stay okay. pause game. Get ready to defend the yeah, zone. Yeah, we got Horde over there that we've got to kill. That's fine. Uh, you guys are idle. We'll tell you what. Jump in the car, and then I'll get you to go home. That's the cool man squad. Operator. And Sagacious, you guys are chilling out over there. And you're still... You know, you could probably be there. You've got a full set of guns. Good. You only have two. If the zombies go here, they're actually going to be in some trouble. I don't know if, like, going home resets the scavenging bar. 
I'm hoping not. I'm gonna send you back to HQ. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna babysit Cool Man Squad over here, wait until they get in the car. There we go, they're in the car. So we will tell them to drive home. I love they put headlights on at night. That's great. And yeah, we do have two people assigned to the wooden tower. There are some infected around here. Currently, they've just got the bow and arrows. Going there. Now, did you unload the car? Oh, there you go. Done, done, done. Which does give us pistol over here, which is nice. I heard a bloop bloop. Something just crash? No, I think we're all good. Did you guys hear that? I heard like a bloop bloop Windows error sound. Everything seems okay. Recording's good. You heard it? I wonder what it was. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Freaky, but everything seems to be okay. So, okay, if we go and disband the army llamas, um, and no offense to them, they've been great, but what I want to do... Oh, is this the army of llamas here? Yeah, run. I was going to say, then we can, uh, we can assign guns to these guys. Oh, they are being shot at! Look at that, probably just by the bow and arrows. And then if these zombies get within range of the tower, any squad that's in here is also going to contribute to shooting them. Receiving. You know, maybe we don't have to disband you. It's going to be fine. How many hit points does the structure have? Not as many as we might like. Oh, there's someone in the car. Roger. In the building. There we go. Okay, we're fine. Another one incoming. Another one incoming? Oh, yeah. I think someone claimed a gun. When, um... There you go, Army of Llamas. When they came here, they grabbed one of the guns out of storage. Oh, that's cool. Well, you know what? We'll leave it like this. Since they do cover the tower right now, I think that's going to be okay. You get free food from killing zombies. Man, I, I wish. I suspect the answer is no. At least we've got some, like, ammo-free shooting going on here. Or eliminated. Good. These ammo counters... Operator. Okay, what time is it? Oh, no, we got a lot to the night because I was thinking about deploying a few more, but now let's go to fast forward here. Let's just. Hostiles inbound. Another horde over here. Infection clear. There are some infected around here. Another horde spotted. It has to have like little arrow markers on the edge. And these hordes, um, at, when daytime comes, they go and hide inside of one of the buildings and you can go and clear them out. All right. I wonder if we can deploy multiple squads to the same scavenging job. Roger. Let's try it. Operator. I'm going to send all three squads out to the Greater Sudbury Chamber of Commerce, the old mall, and see if they just finish the scavenging jobs quicker. <laughs> They're all doing it. Chief, many of our workers don't have any jobs. Send them to gather resources construct or to work at some of the buildings yeah do it we're gonna see oh we don't have enough scavenging to do okay so well we are gonna go i think oh can i st not start on the research center or anything yet because i don't need these okay what well, we need we do need some more scavenging so Let's, we'll scavenge some wood over here. We've got a few trees. Um, and I'll expand the um, the metal scavenging zone a little bit as well. There you go. We'll max out on scavengers. Okay. Another day. Busy again. Squad here idle. Chief, the survivors that we took in, they have some important info that we could use. Ooh, hello. Of various kinds of infected animals. Uh, yes, you can trash a, um, a building as well and get material from them. But they've lost people recently. It'll take some time for them to integrate. Let me find some jobs. As a Project Zomboid dev, this game intrigues me a lot. Right? Like, Robert, like, the vibe is perfect. It, like, it feels like a meta version of Project Zomboid. And if Project Zomboid could have, like, real-world maps so I could play in my hometown, that would also be kind of sick. Um, all right, we'll let them rest for a little bit. Okay. And then we'll interrogate them. Rest. Reporting. On my way. All right, head out over that way. Reporting. Um, we've got some question marks in these two buildings. Let's go and check them out. Receive. This is the uh, the downtown bus terminal over here. Here's a Tim Hortons. 
Oh, that's the LTBO. Sorry. This is the Tim Hortons. I mean, if we're going to be proper Canadians, we should definitely hit up Timmy's, right? Get ourselves some double doubles and things like that. I mean, that's that's the uh, um, the stereotype. Be cool if you could make bridges between buildings for early access. Oh, that would be cool. Yeah, just above ground kind of vibe. Apps of freaking lootly. Oh, I didn't send anyone out with the car. I mean, it's close. I guess we could save a little bit of fuel. I like the carrying capacity. Oh, we found some seeds in one of the buildings. Found some seeds. Mmm. What? It's, I mean, that's what zombies farmers likes, right? Grains or vegan zombies? Is that the joke? What do vegan zombies eat? Grains. Okay. Yeah, maybe we can start farming. We should have a place where we can Although this area is super paved. That would be the one downside. When I did start over here at Casa Mexicana, there was some um, some ground here I could do some farming. I don't know if you can like rip up the asphalt or anything like that. Ready for action. All right, Sagacious Zed, go to Timmy's. Did you find an assault rifle? This will come in handy. This isn't the free prologue. This is actually a uh, early access uh, that the uh, dev sent me. So we're not limited to the free prologue, which is why we could play on this map. Use it with caution. Yeah, our ammo counts are getting low overall too, which is a whole thing. Did we not get any research over here? Building clear. This is the infection-free zone. Please respond. Astrophysicists go brains. A string theory joke, yeah? So this is just on a loop. Chief, this is the same transmission we received before, but the signal is even weaker. Our walkie-talkies so are While the dialogue's going on, you can't actually, like, interact with the game, but we by default, it doesn't necessarily pause, which seems like a terrible idea. University would be a good place to search for information on how to make it work. Yeah, library, university, we need some, we need some tech points, it's and moving. I completely agree. All right, so Gase's Z squad is currently clear. idle. Oh, and pause after the convo. Um, I think... Oh, actually, we got a pin over here. There's a uh, teaching facility. Find some resources. A little book icon over here, too. So, yeah, we're going to try to work on uh, on some tech options. Actually, why don't you return to base first? You can drop off the food and the weapon since it's on the way. That seems like an excellent idea. Need some technical books. Mm-hmm. Shift Q to Q searching. I'll automatically go back to HQ in full. My needs something up. Yes, uh, I, I, I didn't mention the Shift Q. I haven't used it yet. Um, in my uh, little practice, I did that for a bunch of these, like, small buildings over here. I mean, and then you're right. I might be microing a little too much. How does the shift um, queuing work when you uh, want to use the car as well? Yeah, tools, grains, yeah. So we'll, we'll clear this out a little bit more. Roger. Mm -hmm. oh my God, I could play my dad's hometown Japan. Maybe I should check the open map thing they use. Yeah, I mean, I most, I, I suspect like there's probably some areas in the world that don't have the same degree of open mapping available. You know, just like how many places have Google Street View or whatever, but... On my way. Yeah, let's queue up both of those, although it's late enough in the day, they probably won't actually get to finish both, but we'll do some group clicking. Also, the fact that it does look like we can have multiple squads scavenging the same place at the same time might change some of my flow as well. So right now, we don't have a lot of options. We can build a warehouse or a shelter currently, but we can unlock some more things later on. Um, oh yeah, the fields, see? Yeah, see, this is all paved. Yeah, I might still end up having to do some farming way over here, and I, this house is infected! Ah! Reporting. I was gonna say, could you go and help out? You're too far away. Roger. Dang it. Where's the cool man squad? Receiving. Over here. You're currently still scavenging. You're not going to get there in time before the fight ends. Uh, the anti-Z squad, at least they are fully armed currently. Okay, done. No injuries. Just use some ammo. Darn it. Here on, on Elm Street, right? I know, that's perfect. Receiving. Going there. Tell you to do this. I, I clicked on the building again, expecting them to start scavenging and then return home again. And then we'll shift Q you there. So drop off some stuff and then head over that way. Please and thank you. How's the time of day? Nearly night. 
Yeah, I know their inventory is full, but I thought I'll tell them to go there. They'll be like, oh, I have to dump inventory and then come over here. But I guess we actually don't have to collect the grain right yet because we're not actually setting up the farming yet. Although soon, yeah, we need a consistent sort of food and a cookhouse because right now all our food are canned meals. Going there. Why don't you just help that spot? We'll try to finish this as quickly as possible. That actually seems like it might be a good idea. Okay, all my civilians are coming back home. Ready for action. I thought they might collect a little bits at a time, but maybe they don't collect until it's fully done. Yeah. What we're going to want to do once we get some research, we're going to want to go and make this into a... Um, a research center. It's definitely nighttime. Watchtower's up. Squads are squadning. Okay, the scavenging over here is nearly done, which is great. We're going to send both those squads home right away. Reporting. There you go. And you got some knowledge. Clear. Ready for action. There. You don't, but you help scavenge faster, which is fine. Let's get home. Before the Zambies show up. Little man squad. Oh, I seem nervous. <laughs> Any military base, National Guard, and Sudbury might be a juicy target? No. There is! Hang on. Where's the Popo station? Okay, this is the... Oh. Like, uh, building. Oh, man, I played for, like, actually over an hour this morning. I didn't get any bugs. National Bank. All right, so this is City Hall. Oh, right here, gun. This is the police station. There you go. That'll be the place to go. This just should not be continued. Do we risk it? Hang on. Keep going. And I don't think this will be the entire stream by virtue of the fact that, yeah, it's super pre-early access. Spot of the horde over there. All right, let's let's send you home. We need a workspace where we can experiment and re-engineer all the pre-pandemic technology. We could store all the books there, too. Let's build a research center and assign the most technical minds there. Sounds great to me. Okay. Let's do this. I'm going to build a research center right next door. Maximum. Oh, or there we could assign a lot more long-term. Oh, yeah, we are getting some uh, text string errors. We're going to keep going. It'll be fine. I, I don't know if our squads need to rest, but maybe it's a good thing that they're having a little bit of a break over here. There you go. There are some infected around here. I think someone took the uh, assault rifle. That watchtower is being completely eaten up here. How many hit points has he got? Eh, it's still got half. But yeah, come morning, let's go and uh, investigate the police station. We'll send someone in the car to do it. Okay. Morning's up. So, let's send the cool man squad into the car. And... Send you there. An army of llamas. Let's do this and I might shift you a few more food things. Okay. Cool man squad, you're in the car? Good. Drive the car. Ignore the church here. Um... Let's go check out the police station. See if we can get ourselves some weapons. Sir, the people have reported hearing a lot of noises coming from underground. They're afraid that it could be infected moving through the sewers and tunnels. We need to bolster our defenses and be ready to attack from within, too. Okay. We'll be ready. So we need, ooh, okay, this is a big building, so it needs a lot more material. That would be the downside to doing it. We do seem to have plenty of steel, though, and just enough wood as well. So actually, we're fine. Well, yeah, you can assign a lot of workers to that. Um, I'm going to temporarily kill the scavengers. Let's do something like 20 bil builders. Yeah, that's going to take a long time. Maybe I should have just done a small one. It's fine. I guess I could pull the guards off guard duty during the day. Everyone's busy. Oh, Sagacious Zed. Why aren't you busy? Oh, because you already finished picking up this building. You've got all this knowledge. 
Cool. Well, why don't you We're on the move. do these two buildings here? All right. Scavenging at the police station has started. So in the research panel, um, so we've been told to do the basic antenna to increase our range. It takes one research to do it. We'll start. It takes 15 hours, but it's not going to start until we've got the research center going. You know, I really should have put it here because it would have been covered by this uh, tower as well. Is it, you know what? I'm going to cancel this. Yeah, change of plans. Two adapt buildings. We're going to build it over there instead. I think we got to go and pick up that material. Oh, it probably takes time to bring it all there, too. So, yeah, we're going to save a lot of time by just doing a smaller building. We can do it bigger later. Some religious zombies over here. St. Andrew's United Church. It's also a medical center. Uh, so is that, but maybe it is just the church here. Oh, man, the park. A little question mark building, a little abandoned building in the middle of the park. That doesn't seem creepy at all. Okay, everyone's busy. Yeah, hopefully we can find some good weapons. Building clear. Yeah. Reporting. Dumping off some goods, lots of research, lots of medical supplies. What if it's more efficient to use a squad to scavenge a building than use the squad in the car to pick up all the resources? Ah, uh, maybe. And yeah, we can tear down a lot of these buildings too to give us better sight lines. Like, I want buildings near our base. Oh, the other thing too is if we tore down this building, let's say, I wonder if this might expose farmland. Maybe, th maybe we'll do that. Mood's currently dissatisfied. Many shell citizens do not have their own shelter. Do they not want to live in the HQ? Oh, we're over a living capacity. Oh, I hadn't realized that. Okay, well, you know what we're going to do then? We're going to make this building into a dedicated shelter. Building cleared. Yeah, we even get a little assault rifle symbol on this uh, squad to tell us that they've got one. And they're not universally configured for it, but still. Everyone's still busy. You're walking back out here to continue that, which is good. Midday. How's the scavenging? Oh, yeah, we're not even halfway. Tense, tense, tense. All right, fast forward. On my way. We don't have a lot of food either, so it's good that we're checking these places for maybe some more canned food. That's going down so fast. Yeah, we do need to get a farmland going. Okay, I'm going to go with plan. We're going to tear down this building. It's going to give us a billion material. In fact... We can go and stop scavenging. Although, oh, I bet you scavenging is actually what's responsible for tearing down buildings. Yeah, but I'll throw more builders in. No differentiation for ammo type? Okay. It's actually very comforting. I don't know if they're going to stop. You're going to be done with the police station before nighttime. We might just let you go, though. Yeah, all my... All my Citizens are coming back. Receiving. You're heading back out to finish the scavenging. I'm going to go and maybe veto that. Yeah. Tell you what, come over here. It's going to be a lot closer. You can do a little scavenging, but then, yeah, don't be too far away. Operator. Really then, they do have a car. Okay, they're currently picking up ammo crates. Really hoping more for weapons. You need more watch hours if you're expanding? Yeah, possibly. That might be the trick. Infected Maybe what we do is we um, we put a, 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 a foursome of watchtowers, and then maybe we build some walls in between there. We just build this area into kind of a compound kind of vibe. Clear. Clear. All right, done. We're They're loading things into the car. Nice. And then, so from the car, Operator. get back to base. Going there. You got another assault rifle, and you got a bunch of ammo. I wonder if they shoot out their car window. Seems like maybe no. Okay, they're about to finish the scavenging here. We've got an ad break coming up. I'm gonna have to let that one go, I think. Used up a lot of snoozes last time, so it's, things are on a cooldown. Okay, there right now, they're gonna drop off and then go back. I'm just gonna explicitly tell them to go to the HQ and stay there. We're on the move. Port over there. That should be fine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cancel these sca scavenging jobs. 
so the scavengers will focus entirely on tearing down the building instead. Our building is under attack. Receiving. Roger. Go. Get in there. We will have to do a repair on this at some point. But right now it's doing a pretty good job, I think. We've got them. We do have one spare assault rifle. We do this, although I think it needs two ultimately. And it would still use a bam. I'm gonna leave you on a bow and arrow for now. If the cars stop, they shoot. Horde versus horde. Ah. Okay. Oh, oh no! Get back in the building! You were going back to pick up some more goods. That actually explicitly told you to just go home. You're still in scavenging mode. They're gone. Ready for action. Receiving. Um. I'll do it. Ready for action. There you go. I can select all three of these. On my way. I'll send you over here. I know it's midnight. There might be another horde coming. There are some infected around here. But you should scavenge us really quickly. Building clear. There we go. And then it can bulk tell you where is the horde coming from. Oh, from down there, which is fine. Because then it can tell you to go here. If the horde comes, uh, they're just peeing around in the zoo, in the, the the park. Clear. This actually might be a better way to do this. Yeah, one of our assault light rifles isn't equipped. Roger. In this building. Oh, and then they run away. Clear. On my way. Oh, there we go. And it's daytime. Our peeps are going out. Max head. I'm going to pull the guards off guard duty and then put them in scavenger duty. Help tear down the building. I could make our squads. We could YOLO this building here, but I'm not sure that would be a great idea. <laughs> Chief, if we deconstructed some buildings, we require some wood, metal, and bricks for other construction. Uh, make some space. Yeah, that's going to be the plan. Deconstruction over here. It's certainly the idea. Uh, research center is nearly done building. Building repurposed. Clear. Go and everyone's got to do some dumping. All right, we got a research center going on. Seven workers have been assigned. Basic antenna tech is being researched right now. Research complete. Nice. And we can start another research. Once it's operational, we'll be ready to receive distant transmissions again and broadcast them in. Charlie Brown's teacher voice. Yes. Okay. Okay. Let's pause do. a sec. I'm gonna go and build the antenna right in here. It'll be sort of in the center of our compound, so hopefully we won't be too vulnerable to things. We'll get that started. Um, I'm going to take one of the squads off Receiving. of this bulk duty. We're going to put the cool man nacho squad in the car. Waiting orders. Now, was the police station completely... Did I overshoot it? Yeah, okay. There's nothing left in there. I'm just looking for other points of interest with Maybe interesting markers. Um, yeah, nothing we can really tell. Like, if we got the car, we can go to distant locations, but at the same time, maybe, maybe we don't really need that. Maybe I'll just go and We're on the move. shift Q these buildings. Do a bunch of those. We have no workers assigned there right now. We'd have to pull some people off of scavenging. Well, we still have some people assigned to building. They're working on this building over here. You know, that might be fine, actually. And over here, we got 20 workers tearing this down. Oh, and we are getting the resource from this right away. We don't have to wait for the whole thing to be collapsed. That's great news. Car icon below the police station. Um, there's a shopping cart there. Building clear. There were a few um, car icons in a few different places. Going there. I think I kind of like a UI thing that, like, Hold you about idle squads, but you can just leave this open as well. Oh, these guys are idle. Um, Reporting. Really, it looks like they're still. Yeah, you're full of. Going loot. there. I'm your moment, same thing. All right, just Roger. Go home, both of you. Mr. Shack might have a car or zombies. 
Yeah, I mean, we knew this uh, one group of zombies went in there. They're probably still in there. Building clear. Building clear. I like that there's a Massachusetts lane in Sudbury because there's a Sudbury in Massachusetts. Not west, southwest, sorry. Of what? Of this? Or of our headquarters? Stop working. Start winding down for some rest. Oh yeah, end of the day. Civilians coming home. We'll uh, wind that down, max that out. I'll tell you what, I'll max out the builders and then put scavengers back in. But okay, we'll get some people working over here again. Um, Army of Llamas, you're chilling at home. On my way. Okay, so if I do that, then I can do this and we actually will have enough assault rifles. We're really gonna have to repair this. Reporting. Hey, what? Get in the car. We'll bring you home. Ready for action. On my way. You build farms near the mystery ship. Oh yeah, probably in the park. You're right. But I'm gonna hope that we can build them here. Roger. All right, lots of zombies. It says zero, but you're not complaining about lack of weapons. Maybe there's zero more to spare. I'm hoping you have your assault rifles. No, you don't. They're still here. Ready for action. Roger. I am a little confused. Yeah, I don't think these guys are armed. Or maybe they're just not out there right now. Our building's under attack. We might lose this tower. Oh my god, the hordes. There's so many more. They're getting bigger. Yeah, we've got two of two assigned, but maybe... Maybe they don't... Oh, I bet you they don't walk out there at night. They probably only walk out during the day. Yeah, the structure does have a lot of hit points. I am happy we started a bigger one this time. Yeah, they probably only walk out to the tower in the day. They don't want to be caught in the streets at night. I... I you know, makes sense to me. Seems really fair to me. Horde eliminated. Okay. It's still so early. There's so many hordes. Our ammo count's getting more and more down. Although we do have crates of ammo. Maybe they only reload some of the time? Yeah, it's probably time to fix the tower up. Like, repair. Only takes a little bit of wood. We'll do that in the morning. Operator. Going there. I think we can probably afford to do a little bit of this. Infected incoming! Although the horde is coming from this direction. Report. Actually makes me think what we'll do Roger. is we'll send Another one incoming. The second one there and defend this we site. Ooh, we got cut out a little bit in the open. That's not great. We're under attack. Are we out of ammo too? Yeah, okay. How come? Operator. Operator We're on the we have ammo crates. Port spotted. Oh, there you go. You guys have re-ammo. How do we force this group to ammo themselves up? Because it seems like maybe they only refill when they actually run out of ammo? Hostiles inbound. Which seems dangerous. Uh, maybe, maybe that's incentive to just keep them at home when they're at risk of having to fight a horde like at night. Like, okay. Daytime now. Waiting orders. We're on the move. You guys, as a group, go and hit those buildings. Nacho squad, who's pretty badly hurt. We're on the move. Whoops. Head back into the car, please. Waiting orders. Roger. Now, had you seen another car icon somewhere? Where were people saying they might have seen one? There was the police station there. Is it south or the southwest? Oh, right there! On my way. Might be fuel. Could be fuel. Nacho squad sounds like a fun time. I want nachos now. 
Also, people brought up the Putin. I kind of want that now, too. Okay. Walker has no way. Like a pathfinding loss. But right now, yeah, our builders are busy. Scavenger is going that. Chief, we just found a dead animal, but the thing is, it was literally shredded to pieces. It couldn't just be some ordinary infected. This is fine. There are teeth marks on its skin. They look like dog teeth. Zombie dogs! Stay alert. I'm quite curious to see what we might get out of this building. Ready for action. Oh. Sir, we've spotted some people. They're probably armed. They could have seen us too, but I can't tell if they're friendly. None of my squads are in your home. You know what? They're probably fine. Let's approach friendly. Approach them friendly. Did you not find anything useful or did you already load into the car? No, you didn't. Receiving. All right, get into the car. I might need to bring you home here. We're on the move. Oh yeah, no. There we go. Sign you now. We're running out of resources. Yeah, move to. Sir, the winter is coming. Winter is coming. These will be shorter. The farms won't produce any more food. We should brace ourselves. This I'm sorry. We're in September already. Year. Is every day a month? Let's prepare for winter. We don't have any farms in the first place. Building clear. Oh shit! These guys have gone aggro. Okay, it's okay. Cool Man Squad is back at HQ. Yeah, these guys haven't taken those weapons. And they're clearly there. I'm gonna put you back on bow and arrow mode. The citizens are in danger. Waiting orders, waiting orders. Going there. Stupid jerks. I was trying to be nice to you. Hold on a sec. Ready I think this building... No, why are you killing that guy? Okay, you hop into this building. Ready for action. Or the, oh, is the opening on the road? I can't actually tell you to go and attack. Oh, no. Receiving. I thought I, I, thought I told there. you to change where you were going. We're on the move. Oh, yeah, no, you're going into... We're on the move. Going there. Going I want there. the entrance to be on Cedar Street. On my way. Not on this back lane. What are you doing to me? On my way. Okay, just get everyone get into the HQ. I don't know why they weren't being shot from the HQ. It looks like we have line of sight. All right, they're finally dead. Well, that wasn't ideal. Tell you what, I'm gonna go ahead and just disband the army of llamas. We weren't at full strength anyway. Let's try to give these guys pistols. How do we like deliver the pistols to Waiting this? orders. We got it repaired. Maybe this is an area of the game that's not um, fully developed yet. Reporting. Yeah, we got some hit point shortages. I don't know if like keeping people at home will help to develop the hit points or what the deal is. Let's just keep these squads relatively nearby. Yeah, no, we dropped the food they were carrying. And then we killed some dudes with ammo over here. I, like, click on this to tell you to pick this up? Oh, okay, that seems to be the case. All right, let's do that real quick. Civilians are heading out again. Guards need to go get the guns. We're just being impatient. You think so? I mean, we've been on this mode for a while. They're assigned. Oh, did they go and get it finally? They made, okay, I think they did just go and get it. And yeah, so I think partially was like, the first time was at night. I don't think they wander back and forth. There we go, now they're at two. Okay, just pistols, and maybe it should be assault rifles, but. 
Uh, you need to go and pick up this food. Although you're full of resources, so you might have to make a couple little trips here. So we got tons of extra pistols. Maybe we'll go and dish out a second squad after all. We'll see. Oh, this building is getting more and more torn apart as the scavenging is happening. That's cool. Go, delivered. Going there. We'll pick up that food. That's going to be okay. Scavenging here is happening, which is great. Um... Yeah, still looking. I mean, maybe we build the f farm fields over here. It's so far away. I really am hoping. Oh, man, it's going to take forever for this to be finished. Maybe we, we plunder some of these different buildings. Antenna's coming along. That'll advance that. Yeah, I don't know how to heal people. I think they might just be healing over time from being at the base. Like, we do have medicine. But yeah, I don't know if you can like manually heal people because you're pretty hurt. Maybe you should just be staying at base for a little while. Maybe you heal over time at the headquarters. You can keep an eye on those, although they're pretty healthy, so I kind of want to send them out. Let's send them to the PDP. Times it. Yeah, you got enough to do that before the zombies come again. Can't plant them in winter. Construction ready. Okay. Chief, the antenna is now operational. Let's broadcast an invitation as a test, or just call the squads back to HQ. Roger. Okay. Let's start broadcasting. Stop working. Start winding down for some rest. Let's invite some more people. To all survivors, this is an infection-free zone. We provide food and shelter. This is CBC Radio 1. Join us. Okay, nighttime's coming up. Oh yeah, people are going to their little shelters. And yeah, we probably have enough time for these two squads here to strip down the pita pit and then return to HQ before nighttime comes. I'm John Connor. We got the car parked. You actually have pistols this time. And yeah, so what I'm thinking um, is four towers there. Although I'm not sure if the towers are actually strong enough to, um, like, without being covered by something. But, and then building some walls, and then just sort of claiming this whole block for our own. You know? Alright, they're nearly done. I've gone a horde yet, which is great. Alright, building cleared, perfect. So what I'm gonna do is select these two squads. Send them to HQ. They should be coming with stuff. Oh, there's a horde. We'll get there just in time. Although the building's taking a little damage. Oh, that's a lot of hordes. Oh, oh no! There are some infected dogs in Zombie dogs! I haven't seen these yet. Um, well, I mean, run. Do not engage. Run away. Reporting. We're assembling a new, a new squad, so we'll have three squads in here. They'll grab the assault rifles. They're trying to get inside. Oh, they're getting into the residences. No! Yeah, I do have too much text, I think, in the Moobot. And I think it is set to only go every five minutes. Oh my god, they're climbing up on the walls. That's the health of this building. This building is fine. This building is going down fast. We're gonna have to, like, run out there and engage the zombie dogs. Which I hate the idea of. They're gone. Well, one squad's down. Got okay, them. both these squads are down. Waiting orders. Let's get the two pistol squads. Reporting. On my way. Over here. Oh! Okay, the, the zombie dog's bringing you. Maybe way. because my squad's left the building. They're like, oh, someone vulnerable. Get back into the building. Okay, we will issue a repair command on that. Wow. Who moving out now? How can people not live here right now? It's too damaged. They might just be going to the HQ. Glad we could be bait. 2 a.m. Another one incoming! Another horde. 3 a.m. Or the horde might not be getting here before daytime. 
five. Okay, yeah, you know, we're gonna be fine now. Um, Reporting. Waiting order ready for action. Going everyone down. head out over here. Food, medicine. We'll leave the car. So they have gas for when we need to go a little further. Yeah, the doggos really chewed up that house. There you go. Everyone's heading out. How sedible. Well, the zombie dogs, apparently, it is. Food supplies are going up right now, so that's a good sign. Building clear. On my way. Ready for action. We're on the move. All right. We got multiple buildings. Operator. Squad four. Oh yeah, you didn't have your name again. Building clear. I'm gonna queue up this. Squads are gonna be looking for more food. There you go. Work done. Pistol mode, couple of workers assigned to it. Good, you should go and claim some more. Clear. I might have to go and disband one of the squads so that the extra two towers here can have some weapons. Building work done. Dogs show up the house usually because they're bored. Roger. All Jack Russell Terriers. Clear. Okay, clear that down to 30 because some people are eating it. Rebuilding is happening. Okay. Scavenging. Wow, we got a long way to go, but we do have all the reasons. I kind of wish I just started t tearing this down immediately rather than sending anyone out on the map ever to scavenge because that is going to be really good when we've got this space. And there's so many resources and it's not very far. Like they were coming all the way over here to chop down some trees. What is that symbol? Oh, back to green fertilizer. Okay. We need more resources. Out of pistols. Yep. Okay. Building repurposed. Operator. Roger. Okay, we still have queued up jobs. Everyone's still busy. Up down what trees? You know, these whole trees. A kiss for luck. I don't know. There have been enough zombies for a bit that we've got a few. We've got a park over here. I mean, we could just chop down all the trees in the city park. As long as we dodge all the, uh, all the needles on the ground. Gotta be careful about that. Grenade the trees. <laughs> We're playing Factorio now. Okay. All right, it's nearly zombie o'clock again. Done. Head back to your shelters. Building clear. Roger. Yeah, Waiting you know what? Orders. Let's send everyone home. Right We've got a bunch of resources. We'll drop them off, and I'll probably I'll disband one of the squads to open up some pistols. Although they're probably not going to be able to get there tonight. Which actually means that anyone in these places... Hold on. Let me zero out these buildings. Oh, no, they're not going to leave. Oh, they are leaving. Okay, good. Uh, which might just mean they get just chewed on. But we might be able to bait by moving some people out. I just don't want to risk... These buildings are unarmed. I don't want to risk them. Oh, it's snowing! Yeah, it is October, so every day is a month. Which I hadn't realized. Can recruit more personnel. I did put out a call to try to invite more people. I don't know if they came. Maybe what I should do is move everyone here because these two areas should be guarded by these towers. Although admittedly only by pistols. That is a big board. Where are they going? They're smashing up this building? Oh, there's an enemy group in there. Oh, I hadn't realized that. Well, there's not an enemy group in there anymore. They're breaking into our building. We're empty. This place is getting chewed up like crazy. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. We'll queue up um we'll queue up some repairs for the morning. Oh, are they doing it now? Wait, oh, when you go into repair mode, the building becomes inactive. Okay. So I might not have wanted to do it now. All right, listen, let's pop out for a sec. Receiving. Receiving. On my way. There we go. Roger. These hordes. Yeah, we are out of stored ammo. 
Oh my god, how do I play this game? It's so hard! Maybe it doesn't help that, like, may maybe if we played in one of the pre-made maps, the balance would be different, right? That's one of the things, one of the reasons they might still be in alpha, is it's possible that these generated maps are still being worked on for, um, for their balance. Let's do that. What I'm going to do is I will, um, and we won't have the ammo for it anyway, because I kind of need to free up four pistols. So I think I'm going to disband the Sagacious Anti-Z Squad for now. That'll free up four pistols for these towers over here. Now, we can, and maybe this will be the priority, maybe, can we do ammo production here? This makes firearms. How do we actually make the ammunition? Produce ammunition over here. So we'll start researching chemistry and then see if we can get the nitrocellulose powder. Um, we need to research that. So we will have enough research to get it all done. I guess that's the thing. I haven't been doing research and I have people assigned to the uh, the research building. We could have probably freed them up. We could pop more of these question mark sites. Maybe we'll get lucky and get something interesting. I'm going there. Yeah, they are assigning a lot of ammo to the towers. That's true too. So we actually might have more ammo, but it's just being, it's just occupied in these towers for now. Like, yeah, that's the situation. The pros and cons. <laughs> this is over. Who are you? Who are you? Do you realize? You're all gonna die. We're all gonna die. I mean, I do kind of believe we're probably all gonna die. But you know, take it easy there, buddy. Take it easy. Take it construction complete. Do you people understand nothing? Construction ready. I'm gonna listen to him. I'm gonna pause, because I can't UI right now. This is the end time. Get off our comms. Get off our comms. Enemy squad dropped ammo? Oh yeah, and a gun. Oh, I bet it does. Wake up. This is it. Wake up, sheeple! We can't give up. We can't give up. We're all gonna die. We're all gonna die. We're all gonna die. Pros and cons would be a great name for a GTA clone. Pros and cons would be a great name for a prisoner literacy program. That's funny. Okay, my unemployed people. Um, yeah, they're going to go into scavenging mode, keep ripping down this building. Hopefully by next spring we'll be ready to farm in this area. I'm hoping that it's not concrete underneath this, that we can actually go and uh, farm that area. Research complete. Chemistry research complete. So let's go nitrocellulose. And then... Yeah, I mean, presumably. Am I gonna get the buildings or am I gonna have to research on something? And we'll see. All right, you guys are still busy out over there, which is good. These buildings here are assigned and armed. We can double check. We've got a total of eight guards, we do. Um, let's start working on some barriers, especially at this far area over here. So, we do this and build this work. Okay, it is sort of snapping. No, maybe not. I don't know. Can't zoom any more than this. Oh, maybe it's click and drag. Okay, and then if I want to do a metal gate, ooh, rotate, uh, left click for rotate? Oh, left click and move my mouse probably, yeah. Hmm, a little inconvenient. Oh, hold on, I can use that uh, Z and X as well. Let's try that. That's gonna be much easier. So I'll scrooch it up against the grocery. I don't think it took that click. It wasn't red, was it? There we go. Maybe it was at the last minute. And then, oh, actually, it's nice and tight. I think we might be good there. 
Okay. Research complete. Done. Nitrocellulous powder it, research is done. There we go. Okay, we can build an arms factory. Or rather, upgrade one of the buildings to be an arms factory. Done. Building clear. You know, this game's gonna have so much mod potential. That's yeah, true. Our worker can't reach the destination. Well, what can't you reach? Yeah, you'll be fine. I'm sure you'll figure something out. How's my squad? Okay. Tommy dogs can be scary enough. Zombie raccoons. I mean, welcome to Raccoon City. Literally. Oh, yeah. So, um, in the, um, in the, uh, Resident Evil, uh, Welcome to Raccoon City movie, at some point, they go to this underpass, which is right here. On my way. I guess that's why the road ends. See how this road ends here? And it's like kind of weird and disconnected. We got railroad tracks because this is an underpass that goes underneath right here. Um, and that's one of the locations. Uh, I believe there's um, somewhere is the Lido. I guess it's on Elgin Street. Is it over here? Anyway, that's one of the buildings as well. Uh, that is one of the locations. There, the Lido Hotel. Right over here, of course, the Triangle Building. Oh, right across from the arena. We should, we should totally check out the arena and see what's there. But I think that's another site that they use for stuff. I think they filmed a bunch in the old hospital. Uh, which would be... Building clear. Oh. oh, I guess I can't zoom in over here because it's in our unexplored area. Okay. Um, that's the one that's like all painted and colorful as well, if you've ever seen shots of that. All right, squads are still squadifying. They're still moving right now. Construction here is happening. Good. You actually know the map from the movie? I don't actually know the map from the movie. I've never seen the movie. I really should. So yeah, I'm hoping they can't squeeze through these little gaps. I don't know how tight we need to be. That's as good as I could do. Okay, uh, right, it's getting late. So the squad, the, uh, the workers are being recalled. Squads should maybe stay home. That's a little far for them to travel. Receiving. Ready for action. Um, tell you what we're going to do. Going Send you over there, because then we can protect this sort of work area. Or, you know what? Let's keep one squad in the HQ right now. Roger. And we'll put one over here to use this building to hopefully give a little bit of protection to this area. I wonder if... I got vision. I wonder if people will be able to get onto the metal gate. Maybe we don't need this watchtower. Maybe can people can um, fight from the gate itself. Oh, that might change your defense plans. We'll see. 5 p.m. at these latitudes should be dark. I know that's the thing. They might end their day earlier in the winter because of the uh, the limited light. That is entirely possible. Oh, yeah, I still got to go over here, and pick up maybe some more ammo and things. Yeah, you're just scavenging over there, which is fine. Then you're just chilling here, which... Could be better. Clear. Another one incoming. Clear. Horde spotted over there. Stay there, though. Both have made the weather day-night cycle match the city chosen. Yeah, I don't know. For all I know, they did. Okay, there's a horde, but you can watch them sometimes. You know, they don't necessarily beeline for you. They do other things. Incoming. Until they like actually aggro on something, which is clearly happening here. All right, tell you what, come over here. There's clearly a lot of activity in this end of things. How's this tower holding up? Oh, it's about to fall. We're probably gonna lose two people. These hordes are getting tougher and tougher. Reporting. Okay. Go and collect this stuff. Horde spotted. Okay, get back in here. There's a horde. See that? And then it disappeared again. We have limited vision. Okay, it's daytime. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna send a squad over here, collect that. Waiting orders. Let's hit more of these question mark buildings. On my way. Maybe we'll get lucky with something interesting in them, you know?
Does anyone hear me? I hear you. I hear you. This is the infection free zone. Also, zone, I need help. I'm sick. What are your symptoms? Yeah, were you bitten? Fever, cough, chills, had to catch a cold after the last downpour. I need a doctor. Were you bitten? No contact with them. Even if I lived for years, I'm immune to the vibe virus. What? Are you? You have red eyes? Are your eyes? No, certainly not. My eyes are fine, as always. Yeah, we need for help. What help do you need? Need burst in the coughs. Medication? Oh, they got, got COVID! Yeah, for sure. I don't have any. I will repay what I have. What do you have? Lots of food. Been stacking it since the start. Canned meat, soups, you name it. Got some ammo and some guns. Yeah, that sounds great. Can you come here? No, I'm barely walking. Need someone to come help me. Where are you? Thing at house Riverside Drive 62. That's far. But we got a car. Yeah, we'll help. I like how they. I didn't respond right away, so they're like, hello? Guys, 100% you're dying. I'm betting that, like, this person is absolutely gonna F us. Completely. But what could possibly go wrong? Let's send Cool Man Squad out. We get the car. Head out over here. Yeah, what could possibly go wrong? I love the real address. Yeah, like I don't, I don't, I don't know what's over here. I think it's just, I think it's just regular housing. Although, is this? I got a street there. There's an underpass somewhere over here that connects Brady Street. Or am I thinking? Hold on, no, no. It's Elgin Street. It's got an underpass that goes over here. That's what it is. Something like that. Another one incoming. House is infected. Oh. Oh, right over here. What is what building is this? Bell Canada is infected with zombies. Yeah, that sounds about right. A kiss for luck. Yeah, we're, we're trying not. We're not try, we're trying not to dox ourselves here. But yes, a long time ago, a long time ago, a kiss for luck lived there. Ready for action. <laughs> Do you have a metro in our city? No. I mean, we barely have functioning buses. I mean, I don't know. Maybe maybe that's unfair, but. Like, public transit is really poor here. Anywhere on the map you can get more I'm in with cars. That, I don't, I don't know. Um, maybe we need like a filter for the legend over here. Horde spotted. Oh my, a horde! Sir, we reached the survivor. It was too late for him. Uh-huh. He attacked us just as we entered the room. Uh-huh, what a shock. We have little car symbols. That's too bad. Thanks for the report. Hopefully he's still got guns. Car. I don't see any gun things, which, I mean, certainly makes sense with where we are. Yeah, I think we're really gonna have to make our own. Getting some food, 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 food. Oh yeah, there is some more stuff. Okay, yeah, hopefully they'll, oh yeah, they can just load it all into the car. It's gonna be great, excellent. On my way. Operator. We're on the move. Perfect. We're on the move. <laughs> Internet safety, y'all, exactly. Horton Sunbury Winter should freeze. I mean, right? Roger. That's what I think. We're on the move. Perfect. All right, that house has been emptied. We're on the and the move. car is full, so definitely go home. In fact, I'll be explicit and tell you to go to HQ just to make sure you don't queue up something else afterwards. Waiting orders. Meanwhile, over here on Minto Street. Oh, yeah, the Bell headquarters. We're still scavenging. Currently full on food. Uh, we have one idler. We are out of there. resources. Out of wood. Okay, or maybe what we need is more scavenging people. We legit out of Oh no, we've we've got we've got 85 wood, unless it's all just accounted for already. How much wood do you need? Oh you need 107. Okay, so we legit won't have enough for all the construction. That's fine. Tell you what, we'll zero out the builders, we'll go full scavengers for a bit. I don't know if we can tell these people to like prioritize. Going there. Wait. I can't select this building anymore. Oh, I can select the deconstruction job. Okay, good. We're on the move. Going there. I suppose what I could do is I could put down see we got a tree over here. What we'll do, since we specifically are looking for some wood, I'll design designate this wood um, gathering area. I will pull well, let's set this to zero for a sec. Max out here. 
and then remax over here. So we'll have eight people chopping down the trees right in this area just to get us some wood a little bit faster. Squads, Cool Nacho Squad is currently idle. They're still currently in the car. We might want to boot them out of there. Oh, uh, what time is it? I've got a time to go out somewhere, but I kind of think we're maybe we just want to gather stuff nearby. Here, leave vehicle. Apparently we never finished scavenging this area, so let's do that. Pick up the more guns and things. Repair your towers before dark. Um, You're mostly fine. Oh, you are really low. You're right. Repair that. This one's fine. But yeah, we have no one... One building. We had too much construction going on. Go figure. Quill ends up doing too much construction simultaneously, so we're not getting these barriers up in time. Oh, that is poor. Oh, hold on. We're not doing any research. Let's pull everyone out of the research center. I'm going to zero out the workers of the arms factory. There we are. Max out the workers there. Okay. There you go. A little bit more scavenging. Okay, there we are. Will overbuild never. I mean, my the worst thing for that always was always tropical for me. I think I went crazy on that. Food is stable right now. Hasn't really been dipping down or anything yet. No workers over there. No workers assigned there. I like the little yellow icons. Let us know there's no workers. Clear. Building clear. Squad four, I think. I'm a little sad that we lost our squad names, but so be it. Okay, you're picking up a bunch of food, you bring it home. I mean, uh, you'll probably be able to make it out there and back again before nightfall. Have this wish list now, yeah. Are you, like, is it is it cool to watch too? It must be, we got a bunch of people in the stream. And I don't know exactly how far we'll go because we might run into more and more like incomplete missing broken content but it's very tempting we can rename the squads that's why squad one is named there and we can rename you again uh tell you what this will be charlie's dragon squad there we are but we were sort of messing around with like expanding recreating the squads and you know having to rename things okay it's five o'clock yeah the civilians are coming home that's fine i think you can still afford to do this are you done no you're still doing scavenging i guess we never finished scavenging the ymca employment services building i don't think this got no that got didn't get redone so this whole area over here is not currently being watched over it might be fine might not be fine i don't know Spotter, horde spotter from down here, huh? Okay, and you're idling. Yeah, you just picked up some stuff. Great. Now go back to the HQ with your stuff. Hopefully, you don't get caught outside. Meanwhile, Kumai Nacho Squad nearly done the scavenging at the YMCA building. Waiting orders. Oh, and the hordes there. You know what? You've got a bunch of stuff. We'll finish the actual scavenge after. Roger. Head on home right now. Oh, they're gonna go and chew up my buildings here. Well, they might spot my squads. Those are a lot of hordes. Building. Ready for action. Now, I don't think there's anyone over there, but it's still going there. head outside. The building is no more. We're on the move. Right. Okay, into the HQ building. Quick! Quick! Oh god! Oh god, there's so many of them! Oh no! There's too many! Okay, you have to reload. We're empty! We've got them! Oh lord! Another couple of hours of night time. Hopefully that's the end of it though. I don't know if we've got any reloads for the other squads here. And go through this, I don't know. Right now I think it's just like survive. Okay, that'll be the end for the night. Let's send you out over here. Oh, We're running out of resources. I'm gonna zero that out. Oh, that got completely demolished. And that too. I mean, we can get some more supplies back, I guess. Maybe my defenses should be a little closer to home. Seems like you never meant to win. I mean, that's the thing. This might just be one of the games that we love, which is play until you lose, right? We do really like those games on this on this channel. Part of me is like, maybe we should take a look at one of the preset maps 
and see how it feels in that area. Might be a very different ba balance vibe. Get up and off your duty. Receiving. Okay, I'm gonna check these question mark sites. Yeah, you're out of ammo. God. Every night you survive is a day you win. <laughs> I like that. And yeah, we're prioritizing some of the wood chopping over here, which is great because that's what we we're specifically short on. We really need some arms factory up so we can start working on our freaking bullets. Oh, we got another bug. No idea what, what did it. I don't know what it is smart they get the bug reporter though. That's actually brilliant. I kind of want to load up the 911 or, or our 112 operator. I don't have the 112 one. Does okay, who, anyone who's played, at least I don't think so. No. Um anyone who has played those games, the 112 operator, I know it's got the world map, you know, anywhere thing. Um and obviously 112 is like that's the emergency number in Europe, right? Um is it, like, does it still feel fine playing in North America? Because that's kind of what I'd want to do. It's 80%. Okay, tell you what. It's 80% off. It's 5 bucks right now for the 112 operator. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure I've grabbed that. Unless I got a code. I might have gotten a code for it like a billion years ago in my email. That happens sometimes. 112 operator. Looks like the answer is no. I think it's worth picking it up for five bucks. Okay, install, go. We can look into that. So yeah, um, like as far as I know, the 112 operator is just a sequel to 911 operator. So probably better. Where's your location? State your location. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? I'm clicking to fast forward a little bit. Sir! Sir. We can send help! Can, send help. can we? On your own, but we're strong. Hearts got the brave one takes a stand. Oh, they're effed. All right. We can still rebuild. We can survive. We are Play 9 one 1 one 2 Both are good. Um. Oh, neutral. Hello. I might leave uh, Charlie's Dragon sitting at home here for a sec. Sir, the signal is very weak. We don't know what their deal is. Originating from some nearby location. Oh. Oh, over there. We searched the nearby area, checking signal strength. We might be able to locate its origin. Ah! It's like story and development. All right, sounds great. Are we gonna get a pop up for these guys? One of people never know. Yeah, we're gonna keep. We're gonna keep a squad here to defend. Meanwhile, okay, cool man's still busy, which is good. Oh, uh, we do need some more people. I mean, do I assign to builder right now? How many? Okay, we've got enough wood to get that started. Okay, I'm gonna go and send some more builders out. We're running out of stock. Running out of basic tools. Ah! What happened to the car? It's it's currently parked over here. That's the thing. We can throw um, we can throw some people into this car. Okay, you know what? Go out here, pick up this stuff. Hopefully these guys aren't jerks. Need some Sir, bullets. we've encountered a group of people willing to join us. Yeah, I'm gonna accept them. We can rob them. No, I'm gonna accept them. Send them in. We need some extra muscles. We've got some food. Area scavenged. Throw some more builders in here. Looking forward to finishing this arms building if we can. Operator. Drop this off. We'll get some extra guns. We don't need the extra guns right now. Mostly it's about picking up these extra bullets. Operator. Which I'm hyped for. Yeah, what is our living space? Right now, you're full and our HQ... Okay, slightly over capacity. So we'll probably lose a little bit of satisfaction here. So we actually do need another living space. But right now, we got to prioritize getting our arms factory up and running. There's just no other choice. Charlie's... Um... 
don't know if we need to go there. Maybe we'll throw you into the car. Roger. You've got bullets now. You've got the assault rifles. What time of day is it? Oh, it's nearly nighttime. Mm, yeah, we're not going to drive across town um, at night here. That seems like a really poor idea. Going there. Yeah, just stay in the HQ for a little bit. Actually, you know what you're going to do? You're going to come over here. Where's, uh... Waiting orders. You're going back over there. Oh, it's got bullets. We're on the move. Ready okay. For Here's plans. Roger. Get in the car. Operate. From over here, we're going to help uh, unpack this building over here. Which actually means we don't really need to see then the cool man squad, because you're not going to... You don't need the capacity. Roger. You can just go and sit in home. You've got some bullets. You can re ammo yourself as well. You guys will do a quick pickup over here. Yeah, the guns are out in the open, I know, but we don't need more pistols right now. We just need more bullets, which we are collecting presently. Waiting orders. Roger. On my way. Say so unload into the car, buddy. Ready for action. There you go. Back into the car. Come home. Going there. How's the construction here? Still waiting for delivering the materials. Do we have enough tools? We might not have enough tools to build this building. Oh my god. Going there. Okay, here's what I propose. I want to kick a quick save here. I want to load up one of the other maps and have a look around. I could make a new squad. I mean, I don't know if we have enough ammo for it, but we could make a new squad. Waiting orders. We're on the move. Uh, we'd have to take um, some people off of things. Let's do that, and then create a new squad out of that. Oh man, these. Visuals are really cool. Okay, so let's do a save. We made it to at least day 10, which is pretty good. Now, if we exit to the main menu. Uh, actually, maybe I should do another full quit of the game. Hold on. Let me do a full exit of the game. And then we're going to load up one of their bookmarked maps. I think the advantage of the bookmarked map as well is that it's like pre-downloaded. So, you, you know, if you don't have internet access for like a live map load up or anything, it's going to be there. But I'm curious to see if the resource count is different. You know, how does it determine what kind of building gets what kind of stuff? And in hindsight, should I have like set up like in the police station to start off with? No, I don't know if I'd get the guns. Maybe I set up right next to it. So you loot it early. So if we go new game, so I mean, and again, we can go to any city, but they have Crofton in USA, Dijon, France, Cambridge, UK, Templin, Germany, uh, Jinhua in China, Taiju in China, and Peschiera in Italy are the bookmarked locations recommended. So let's load up one of these recommended locations and see why they're, they're recommended. Which one would you prefer? Buongiorno, UK, USA for plenty of firearms. Oh, we got some, hmm. Let's go to the Ook. Let's go to the Ook. Yeah, I wonder why they chose those locations. Do they have team members there? You know? Mm -hmm. Only knives in the UK. <laughs> oh! The world as we know it is gone. We get a cutscene! What we called the mad virus appeared out of nowhere. We didn't get this for the custom map. It made people turn extremely violent, aggressive, and unrestrainable. Soon later, the infected became bloodthirsty, more like vampires than human. There was chaos. I wonder if the gameplay is more stable too on these, uh, desperate people were you know, just as dangerous as the virus itself. Even our loved ones could become a threat. The infection spread quickly throughout the entire globe. Every region, every country, every city. What about Madagascar? Are they okay? Did they close their ports? To get rid of the infected, but they all failed. The last chance for those who seemed immune was. I haven't seen the cutscene before. That's why I said about the underground bunker. No. Ones that we improvised. It didn't play for the custom map. Basements, loaded with food, water, and air filtration systems. These were the places where we survived, sealed from the outside. For New Zealand's probably safe. Yeah, well, New Zealand's not even on any maps in the, anywhere in the world, right? Info that a cure had been found, the situation stabilized. Instead, 
and listened as the world grew quiet. Yeah, kind of like vaults, yeah. Our resources were becoming depleted. Life support systems were failing. And just as we were losing all hope, we received a distant call. This was the impulse we needed. There were others out there. We could come back to the surface. No more hiding. From the ruins of the old world, we will build our new home. Good cutscene. Good intro. Yeah, sad I missed that earlier. Oh, and it picked our headquarters to start off with, too. Operator, this is first squad leader. We made our way out. The neighborhood looks deserted. We'll have to scavenge the nearby buildings for any useful resources. I bet you this would have been a better way to start. But how can I not go for my hometown, right? Okay, find something to eat as fast as possible. All right, we got enough guns. So yeah, right away, we're going to go for a second squad as well. We got two of them. I could actually go a third squad, only half arm. That's fine. You know what? That's okay. Do we? Oh, I don't have the overlays up. Uh, yeah, scavenge you overlay. Get the, we'll get the street labels as well. Although, oh, there it is. Did we get them up close? <gasps> There's a hospital right next to us. Hold on. Even with the scavenge view. Oh. Okay, it wasn't working with the button, but when I hit V, it worked. No question marks. The hospital. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we're getting a very different intro situation. Operator. We'll have... Oh, why do they have little wall icons? Is that because you're secure in here? I haven't noticed those before. Let's have you move out, like, as groups. I don't think I correctly selected. You know what? That's fine. You can loot some different buildings this time around. Okay. I gotta say, without being in, a, like, a metropolitan center, like the city street, though, it feels like this would be a lot harder to sort of, like, fence off because we don't have a natural defense structure. Viruses ate their accents. I know. I was kind of thinking that myself. Clear. Are we seeing these? I wonder if, are these tougher buildings? They're boarded up in the, in the windows. And yeah, farming's gonna be a lot easier here too. Excuse me. Hmm. Still April, all right. Loot, loot, loot. The cans. Oh yeah, we gotta return them to HQ, which will happen at some point. And they're all filled up, there you go. Squad three, returning some of the cans and some bullets. We got bullets right away. The Unless they, they're just packing some extra bullets with them. No, they're not. They actually went and got some bullets early. Wow. Reporting. Hey, what? You go and do those buildings there. I am infected. Oh, no. Faculty of Classics and Museum of Classical Archaeology. Dang, man. Building clear. Game set in Eastern Europe. Well, this is supposed to be Cambridge, UK. Which, I mean, it is the map. I don't know if, like, the building architecture is a good fit for it. And we do have some markers for some places. Teaching facilities so we can get some tech out there. Hopefully we can get a car. Although, of course, this being in Europe, the cars won't be as big. So they won't have as much capacity. I don't think that's a mechanic, but... Hey, Apple Applebee. Going there. Oh, nice! Well, thank you. I hope your channel's going well. HQ. We have to think what to scavenge first. It will going be best there. to check some shops or warehouses. Okay. It might be actually more interesting with so many question marks near our area. Although, I guess, theoretically makes the game a little harder. Chief, I will... Oh, yeah, these are the ones who are looking for more shelters. Which, I mean, yes. we really don't have a that big spot here. Oh, yeah, we have 40 people and only room for 15, so... Let's shelter you up Building clear. to start off with. Also, uh, yeah, we have a lot of idlers. Let's uh, quickly do some gather wood in the area where we just around where we are. Max out those scavengers. There we are. So we know we're going to need some wood pretty early on. Uh, we got some idle squads. Tell you what, go there, 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 there. Operator. And going there. there we go. That'll keep you busy for a little while. 
<clears throat> Cars will be electric, never run out of fuel. <laughs> oh, the European cars should have more miles per gallon. Yeah, their mileage should be better. Travel farther without as much fuel. I always laugh when you like go online and you see people like comparing screenshot like photos of like standard, you know, the most popular car in North America, most popular car in Europe, and like the size difference. Mm -hmm. clear. What if you have to worry about utilities getting shut down the project on, but I don't know if they have any utility. I don't think power is like simulated, at least not in the current build. Full set of constructors, just using wood, and we didn't have enough to get started. We could probably do another one as well. On my way. Yeah, the, I think the Ford F-150 is the most popular car in Clear. US, maybe Canada as well, I'm not sure. Squad here's idle. Let's go there. and up clear up these blocks We're over here. Get everything going. Sun setting. Same thing we saw before. Well, our squads are going to continue out there. That's going to be fine. I know the unarmed civilians will return home. That's fine. Our squads don't have to return home immediately. They can keep working. We've got time. Everything's okay. <clears throat> Drive my dad's F-150. So annoyingly big and cumbersome. Kind of hate it. Yeah. Yeah, smile just horrendous. I'm sure it is. Okay, so I kind of just want to see a glance here. Oh, I'm, not, I'm tempted to continue, but I'm thinking about like switching to something else for the other, the second half of the stream. But I don't know. How do how do people feel? People did tempt me with like, oh, maybe we do some flight simulator today. That could be it. Could do something else. I mean, we could pop into City Skylands, but we can keep going here. Dwarf Fortress. Stay with zombies. Yeah, group of infected. Get ready to fight. Clear. Receiving. Um, the move. We're finding ammo in these buildings. Oh wow, this is such an easier start. Holy cow. We're on the move. Flight sim and check temp here. Ready for Going there. Get in there. Operator. Everyone back to the HQ. I don't know where they saw the horde, though. It might not actually be coming. Another one incoming. Oh, there it is. There are some oh, and there. They're small hordes, though. Just a couple in each. Yeah, this first night is crazy easy. Which, I mean, fair. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab two of these squads Operator, and just orders. get them to the start scavenging as a group. One leave one guarding the uh, headquarters. <clears throat> Lesson learned: the Avenger Zombie Apocalypse quilted better. Hope he's on vacation. <laughs> there you go. The scavenge. Then they could fight if it comes up, but they're okay right now. Yeah. Another one incoming. Clear. There are some infected around here. Building clear. Building clear. And then just stay in here. Well, that's a big horde. Well, maybe less aggressive the first night. Okay, nighttime's basically ended. Receiving. Horde spotted. Receiving. Operator. So I think the down. hordes are probably looking for a place to hunker down for the day anyway. Hostiles inbound. Earn your key. There you go. Building clear. Cool. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, Do you flight some Cambridge? You could airdrop supplies. We should build some yes, the storm hit one point. Oh, that's true. On my way. I think it's easier because you found a lot of question mark buildings. Yeah, the question mark buildings might be better. Like it might be unknown and fixed, but it could also be that there's actually a potential for randomized loot. In which case, that is excellent. Apparently, the zombies are hiding out in there, and we might want to clear them out, but. I'm just wondering with like all three squads selected, if the way to go is to just do this, keeps the squads nice and busy. I don't have to worry about requeuing things. Chief, they finish each building very quickly. Cause like if we send three squads out to three different buildings, in the end, all three buildings will have been scavenged in the same amount of time. But we have to wait for each one quite slowly. Here, 
we do them uh, because we're doing them serially. We finish one very quickly, get the resources from it right away. Finish the next one. In the end, it'll be the same, but we get things along the way. Yeah, yeah, everything's fine. Okay, let's gather some wood. Building clear, clear. That's probably correct. Clear. Jim, there are signs of smoke. It's coming out of a building. Try to deconstruct small buildings, check to see if you get ground road. Yeah, just just for info. Yeah. Uh, we prepared, we adapted a building, but we do need to do more. I think we'll go ahead and adapt. Let's um, investigate. One more. Well, what I'll do, I'll do this. God. Okay, I should. We need more resources. What do I? Oh my, I kind of want to keep going. <laughs> it's really good. Okay, let's do a vote. Let's do a vote and see how we are. Because I also want to fly. Also, Dungeon Crawl sounds good. We could consider starting a dwarf fortress. Where's my poles? Poles, 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 poles. New pole. What to play? More um, infection free zone. Uh, simulate horror. Uh, dungeon crawl stone soup. Um, cities skylines. Get some requests for Rimworld. Apparently, I can only put five things in the list. Building clear. Okay. Anything else I want to take out? A star system. Let's put in these. You've got two minutes to vote. Starting now. Hey. Meanwhile, see, squads are still busy too with like sorting them this way. I mean, it might not be the most efficient for like movement. No, no, no. I think it's still pretty good. Where's the car? Way over there. Tell you what, squad one. I'm gonna get you to hike out to this car. Oh, the check train. Yeah, I didn't have last train home on the list. I think that's fine. No, I guess the storm. I, I know it's full of the list. Last uh, against the storm, pretty good. Didn't get the pole. Oh, I am. Building clear. Uh, it, right now it is like massively in favor of continuing infection free zone. Massively. Although I guess I should change the title because we're now in the UK. On my way. Roger. Vehicle taken over. Waiting orders. All right. Well, since you've taken over the vehicle, let's go ahead and just do these buildings real quick. Speed up our scavenging. And we can run over the infected if they get too close. I do have a rogue trader, Warhammer 40k rogue trader. We could have poked around. You play in the UK, we'll see a royal zombie. I mean, haven't we had a royal zombie for a few decades now? I'm on my way. Clear. I had to go for a moment. We're having the last place. Kind of just wanted to see another map. It was starting to be more and more uh, challenging. It'll be interesting to see around day ten in this map if it's just as hard. But I think we're getting a better balance of lootables. Is what's going on here? All right. Yeah. There's like. It's like 61% versus 18% versus 13%. Like more infection free zone is definitely winning. So let's do that. Um, I wonder how quickly I have to respond to the smoke here. It's way over there. Well, I guess that would be for the uh, the car squad. The car full? No? Okay, good. Yeah, good. Be in the car. You've got some capacity. Let's send you way out here to the house on fire. Although if I recall correctly, wasn't there like a horde in there when we got the event previously? On the other map, I feel like there might be. We also know there's a horde in there, but I'd rather not storm the building. building clear. I want to vote for against storm, but you play whatever. Against storm is really good. We actually would have enough time for a session of against the storm. We'll see. I'm gonna keep going for now because I'm still enjoying this, and I kind of want to see how some things shake out. Chief, we found some survivors. Oh yeah, I, I, I want to accept the new survivors, Bring for them sure. In. And then, oh, you are scavenging this building at the same time, which is fine. And that should bring you nicely to the end of the day. This squad here, I'm going to send you over here. I'm not going to send you back out to the front right now. I don't think we've got enough time for you to get there. So we'll just keep an eye on everyone. Their civilians should be back in. Oh, we have a bunch of unassigned people. Oh, I might not have a um, scavenging zone set up anymore. They might have grabbed all the trees already. 
Let's consider busting down a building here. I'm trying to think of like, like position for things. If we want to keep the buildings that are nearby, maybe I should bust something down that's a little further away. Maybe we'll do this one because it's sort of a little exposed or even this one over here. Maybe this one here is a good um, option. We'll set that one to be deconstructed. Clear. Survivors, they could, given the fact that it's nighttime now. Operator. That actually would be... I think they'll make it home before the, the zombie hordes show up for them. I think we're okay. Are you, okay, you finish that. You're going to go home. Going there. Yeah, these guys are going to make it just fine. Clear. Squad Operator. three, get home, deliver your goods. Maybe from that ring of buildings. Oh, inside the ring of buildings. That actually does sound pretty smart. I like that. Building clear. On my way. Ready for action. Roger. Building clear. And there was nothing in it? Really? A little disappointing. Do I dare... You know, over here, I'll we'll be able to scavenge from that pretty quick. Where are you going? Receiving. Are you going back out to the car, maybe? Probably. I'm going to send a couple people into this building. Because it's pretty close to home, and it should actually cover one of the zombie approaches. I think that's going to be all right. Do we just build, like, a giant fence? Just fence this all in? Board over here, but these guys are well covered in this building. Up, up, up. Good. Oh, you guys are idle, so you're done scavenging this building entirely. Okay. Ready for action. Get ready to defend the, the zone. Orders. Roger. Receiving. So just get home real quick. Hopefully you don't get caught out in the open too much. Oh, I think these guys are hiding in this building. Well, then tell you what. Roger. Why don't you jump into this building and help ready for uh, defend that? I think We're the on zombies. The yeah, okay. Everyone in this building, please. Protect these new civilians. Port spotted. We've got them. Cool, you got me hooked against the Stormers the past it a year ago when you first played it. I decided to give it a chance now. I mean, it keeps getting crazier and crazier. Every update really does a lot of great work with it. Port spotted. Okay, let's stay there just because the civilians are holed up in that building. Although the next ward is coming from Operator, on my way. this angle, so maybe we'll double up our firepower from that side. Port, spotted. Our building is under attack. Yeah, you're fine. You know what this reminds me of? What's that game called? Like they, there are billions or whatever. This is like a We've got them. city building. We've got them. Building. We lose anyone? Operator, another one incoming. I think there used to be six group members. Maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. Going there. Maybe I'll double up on that. that was it. Okay. Incoming. I think the hordes are gonna be settling in now. I think we're probably fine to break our defense. So what I'm gonna do is just queue up tons of collection over here. I mean, this horde is still out, but yeah. There you go. You see the civilians going away, and yeah, the horde's going into the building. Okay. Chief, we just found an assault rifle. This will come in handy against large hordes. Use it with caution. Nothing. Maybe we don't want to equip the assault rifles at all until we get the bigger hordes. I don't know. Clear. And... We do have some idlers. Do I want to smash down another building? I think what we'll do is we'll take this one down as well. I'm going to call this one outside the perimeter. Okay, there. No one employed. So everyone's going to be busy. Clear. Me too just started a game, but they are buildings constructed. That, yeah. I, mean, I haven't played an extensive amount of that, but it was pretty good. The survivors that we took in, they have some important info that we could use. You know, this time I'm going to go for the interrogate instead of arrest. We have no time for that. Building interrogate them now and get as much info as you can. Building clear. On my way. There we go. We have the extra living quarters now. Uh, 
Um, no extra weapons. I could still make another squad, although if they wander into a building that happens to be full of zombies, that would be fairly bad. Chop down these trees from inside this area here. Because if we want to set up some farming, that might be good. A lot of good there, billion type games right now. Age of Darkness Final Stand's a good one. Who is there? Car icon to the east. Who is there? We got a library. Oh, over there. So I suspect might be fuel. Generally, rather than a car, per se. But I mean, fuel's pretty important. Going there. I'm going to take one of these squads and just clear these two buildings right there. So, is it worth building the wooden tower? Like, that's the thing. These towers, I'm not entirely sold on their defensive potential. But, again, maybe here. Maybe just so that we can watch both sides of this road or right here be like with the idea that we're going to fence over here. And it would be covered by our headquarters. I mean, we've got a quest for it, so I guess we may as well. Time you to get a lot of fuel. Think, you think bow tires all me? And that might be the right thing to do, is just leave them with the bows. Not use any extra ammo. And everyone is still busy. Yeah, this, this mass queuing is actually very convenient. Wooden towers without walls or nothing. Yeah. There's gaps over here. What we could do is we could build a wall, like, right in this area. Even consider building our farm fields right here. We're on the move. Clear. Yeah, towers are attacking your other buildings, but I mean, the towers themselves are very vulnerable, so I'm not sure that how much of a win that is, is the issue. Clear. Oh yeah, this is the, the one on repeat. Let's go there. Build the comms tower. Which I do want, because if we can get some more survivors a little faster, that would be good. We have to build a warehouse. Okay. Apparently. We'll build one. I mean, I guess we do, because we never got that message last time. Yeah, it is pretty full. I think we convert one of these buildings. Maybe this old hospital. What if we convert this one to a warehouse? Right? It seems relatively reasonable. We need a workspace where we can experiment and re-engineer all yep. the pre- As I was saying, we need a research center. Okay. I think I'll build it right across Let's the street. Or do we build it in here and then maybe we make this whole block a little self-contained. I'm going to do that. Hold on. Let me cancel this. You're going to be our research center. And then maybe we can make this one into the workshop afterwards. We're on the and yeah, we could claim all the buildings around here and then do the farming. And then maybe just finalize some of the fencing. I don't know. Then, yeah, we could tear down these buildings over here just so that we could build a nice square area. I don't know. All right, everyone is busy. How about our squads? Oh, squad one is not currently busy. Oh, yeah, come over here for some knowledge. We'll do that. Uh, just do that, and then I think that will end your day. So I'm not even sure you've got enough time to do this. Maybe I should have sent you out with the car, but it's a little late now. Get back to your shelter. Building clear. Yeah, it does. It does tell you uh, how much you would get out of these buildings. That is a good point. And, you know, I, I'm wondering if like so we can we'll be able to fit 18 workers in here. Another one incoming. 13, five, just one little one. And that's the thing. This might be an overkill for research. It probably is an overkill for research. The research seemed to happen pretty fast and it takes a lot of material. Maybe we just want a little research building after all. No, maybe this one over here, just a couple. Just a little research. We'll do this. Oh, but it did have a zombie symbol earlier. That's right. And it looks like we're taking him out okay with no injuries. I mean, obviously some ammo, but we're also we're either we'd be fighting them at night otherwise. So. Receiving operator. I think I'll bring these two home now, because I think these zombies and stuff are going to pop pretty soon. So. We're on the move. 
Let's do that. Oh, I didn't mean to select you, actually. I want you to stay in the... You. Ready for action. Stay in this building. We're on the move. Requesting support! Now you're getting hurt because you want... You're out for, like, two seconds. There you go. Now you can stay in there. You can scavenge that building and defend from it. It's probably fine. Everyone else get in the main HQ. That's going to be okay, too. Hey, Nero. Zombies like reading books about zombies. Yeah, they're hanging out over here. The Hermitage? They're trying to get inside. Can I not shoot them from here? I'm assuming... Mm. We can't let them get into the shelter. What I'm hoping is if we pop out for just a second... We're on the move. They'll probably aggro against us. Yeah, there we go. Now get back in the shelter. There we go. I guess one of the things, if I put a tower right here, for example, right, that cover that, and these zombies that would come here for this building, they'd get drawn to the tower and then get pulled into our further line of fire. That might be a way to go. This is a nice killing field here. Clear. So actually, maybe this tower is not the place to be. I'm going to cancel that construction. Hostiles inbound. Yeah, fire lines and sight lines are going to be very important in here. Definitely something we're going to have to be considering. Oh, are you done? You're idle? You know what? You don't have to come home. You're not caring too much. Just go to the building next door. You spotted the horde. Some survivors were there. I wonder if I send people over to that building. And yeah, stock stockpile is full. But we're going to warehouse this, which is good. I think we want a fairly large building for a warehouse. Another one incoming. Clear. You're clear. Why don't you try to get home? I think. Yeah, that'll be fine. Actually, that group being out pulled the horde away from this building, which is great. We're going to queue up a repair, but not until um, the day, because what's going to happen is apparently the building becomes inactive, and so all these people would run out to the HQ, which we don't want right now. I love seeing them climb up the walls. I don't want to zoom in even more. Okay, good. We might be okay now. There are some infected around here. There might the the next horde might not make it before the daytime comes. Okay, at four, I'm gonna say we're fine now. Hostiles inbound. Waiting orders, waiting orders. Okay, they're there, but I think they're just gonna go into a house. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here. We know there's a group of survivors. We're gonna send our entire squad in at once in case they're hostile. There are some infected around here. Okay, infected there, but yeah, I think they're just about to bail and go inside a house. Or we can just fight them in the open here and probably overwhelm them with firepower. Yeah, they've gone inside. It's daytime. Our own people are going out right now. Good. So let's um let's do a quick repair of that building. Sir, the people have reported hearing a lot of noises coming from underground. They're afraid that it could be infected moving through the sewers and tunnels. Huh. Maybe there are no people there anymore. Defenses. Maybe they left. Ready to attack from within, too. We'll be ready. Oh, there's some people. Sir, we've encountered a group of people willing to... Yeah, uh, we're going to accept them. Send them in. Building clear. Find some builders. I didn't realize we didn't have any. Build tower to lure zombies in the line of sight near your base. Yeah. I mean, they still need to see the tower. So I'm wondering about a tower right here. I think that's, I think that's kind of what I want. Oh, there we go. We found the farming site. That's good. Okay, bring that in. I don't like that you can't UI okay. while the conversation's the happening. Cookhouse. But yeah, what I'm thinking is we wouldn't tower right here. So to cover this blind spot. I think that's the spot for it. I hope they don't turn hostile while my troops are away. No, we're good. Okay, good. Clear. Send some more builders.
Scavengers are all coming back at once. What? What's going on there? Why are they doing a little dance? Building clear. All right, squad is all idle. Zombies over there. Maybe we just ignore them for now. I don't know. We can probably hang on. Let's let's go ahead storm the building with everyone. Um. Operator. Squad. One, two, three. Select everyone. Go. Roger. And then Q. There we go. Oh, it's still tons of stuff left in this building here that we need to loot. Think killing zombies in there is easier? Maybe. Yeah, it's uh, it's not Google Maps, it's Open Street View, but yes. Oh, Squad 2 is out of ammo. Building clear. Well, Squad 2, why don't you go home? We're on the move. We got ammo in the base. You're gonna be fine. Yeah. Yeah, there's stuff left in the house. We'll have to collect that soon. Yeah, we'll make sure that Squad 2 goes and re ammos themselves. Maybe we'll send them to go and pick up this stuff. There's so much stuff, we should send them in the car, maybe. Because it's gonna be a few trips. We'll need to unlock the basic antenna when we do get a research lab. See, what's going on? Why are the people leaving the scavenging site and then Clear. coming back? Oh, maybe they're trying to dump it off, but now this is full. You don't have any wood. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna cancel the scavenging job here. And... Expand the explicit wood scavenging. And then do this. Same thing as before, we're getting a priority for some more wood, because the idea is to build this warehouse so that we can store more stuff. We might have a little bit of a chicken and the egg problem going on here. Going there. Going there. Yeah, I think that's what's happening. Um, hmm. Going there. The problem is they're not collecting the wood because the stockpile is full. Maybe they can use up a few resources doing some repairs? I think I think there's a little bit of an issue with what's happening here. They're not collecting the wood because there's no room in storage. We can't build the new warehouse because we don't have any wood. And they might not just leave it on the map. Send squads back to get ammo. Although they don't collect the ammo until they're actually empty. Is there a way for us to dump resources? Like, just dump it outside. Oh, you're doing repairs right now. Yeah, no space in stockroom, no workers. Put stuff in the car. Maybe. I mean, zero out on scavengers, max out on builders, then go and put the scavengers back in Going here. There. Operator. Adaptation complete. Roger. Okay, well, something just finished. There you go. You're progressing. Okay, they are working on stuff here. Maybe they're consuming the wood. Maybe just getting more builders going is going to help. Going there. Think things are going to move to the warehouse site? Okay. Yeah, maybe with more builders, things are going to work better. We'll finish this tower. There we go, which is just finishing up now. We don't have spare guns for it. Construction ready. So yeah, we'll just put you on bow and arrow mode. That's going to have to be okay. Building clear. You want to leave the car there? Uh, yeah, not really, huh? I didn't realize. I'll have to get someone to pick that up. I guess they weren't loading this stuff into the car. Oops, the car even has wood in it. Building clear. Operator. You go to the car, the and then we'll send you back to drop that stuff off. And they are they are scavenging some wood, which is helping. And the warehouse is definitely being made. Okay, I think we're gonna be fine here. Cars are from the evil before times anyway. Sla Reddit.com slash r slash f cars, right? Yeah, we have no wood stockpiled. 
And I think, yeah, I think we, we are ending up with this like weird, there. like a little bit of a deadlock. On my way. Squad one is Waiting in the orders. car. Roger. Actually, up and over here, way. pick up as much as you can. The load into the car. Going Back there. in there. We're on the move. Yeah, get some more. Roger. Get in the car. We're on the move. Yeah, just go Back home. There. And then park it. Okay. Squads are otherwise busy. They are. Clear. You're still waiting for your wood. Come on, chop down the trees. And you're Operator. just chilling over here. Um on my way. Let's have you head over here, although it, nighttime is coming. Going there. Tower's got workers. Yep, two guards in there. Good. Just with bows and arrows. Civilians are coming home. That's fine, too. Squad over here. I'm going to get you to uh, come home. You're pretty far from home. Let's get back. There's more resource to be picking up. We're leaving cans of food in a few places. Although we don't necessarily have space for it. We do have enough food currently. So maybe I should stop bringing food back to base. Reporting. We're missing resources. On my way. Back to base. Stay there. How far can you zoom in? This far. And then for zoom out, we do get this cool transition to this mode, which I love. All right, hopefully tomorrow we finish this warehouse and that'll help our uh, our goods flows a lot. Receiving. Port spotted. Port spotted. I'm just gonna finish the scavenging job so we at least know what's here. You're not gonna Clear. be able to pick up anything from your full. I'm gonna officially tell you to just go home. All right, so everyone's gonna be in the HQ. We do have our guard turret tower here, which should cover this angle. And then division, we might need one on the other side to get the front of this building. Okay, that worked well. Obviously, we've got a clear line of sight over here. Good. Someone's got the assault rifle equipped as well, which is great news. Lovely. These guys are doing a little dance. And, oh, yeah, now they're going home. Okay, so we can send our people out again. Ready for action. Ready for action, operator. And... Well, I really don't need you to bring home stuff because we still don't have the capacity. So I guess I'm just going to tell people to go and just... At least we can go and explore new buildings and know what's there, even if they don't bring the stuff back. Wake up and do your job. Getting pinged, I guess we're being reminded that we can do things. Um, let's actually get these fields down. Might use up a few resources to plop them down too. Although if you need wood, that might be slightly annoying. But you don't have workers assigned yet anyway, so that's fine. Okay. Yeah, no, that's okay. Because the construction workers are all in the warehouse. We do need that to be finished and otherwise chop down all the trees in the world. Good. Trees are the enemy, not the zombies. Clear. Building clear. Going there. Roger. Come on, warehouse. Building repurposed. I think they're waiting for more wood to be delivered before they can work on it. Building money clear. for Essentia. Money for Essentia. Oh, they, hey, they Thank grabbed the car the on their own. Content. That's nice. Happy holidays. Whoa! Holy cow. Uh, thank you very much, effective gnome. That is very generous. Happy holidays to you as well. Holy cow, thank you so much. Oh, the lab is finished? Thank you. We've got workers, uh, and they are working on the research right now. Good, good, good. Ha! I like the little dancing dinosaur emote. Uh. Speaking of which, how did your master splinter heal? Uh, my, uh, my toenail still looks a little funky on that foot, but otherwise, yeah, it is, uh, it is looking okay. Thank you for asking. Warehouse finally finished. Okay, so that's gonna solve our resource supply issue dramatically. Um, zombies might go and start punching this warehouse, though, which I would not appreciate. A new car up north? You actually see the cars? Just as you saw the symbol for a car. Oh, shit, there's a bunch of cars. Ready for action. Roger. Waiting orders. 
Reporting. On my way. Let's get all the cars. Dancing Dinos is a global emote. Is it? I don't spend enough time chatting on Twitch. It might be broken, yeah, but well, at least we can poke around and see. Clear. Scavenging is a go. Bringing stuff home. Yeah, if we get some workers, um, do I want to lower this? Well, no, we still mostly need wood, so I think we still just focus on some tree chopping. Chief, we just found. Okay, we got the dead animal event that sort of gives us a hint that there might be some psycho dogs. Stay alert. So that's great. That is a long hike out there. Going there. It'd be great if you could pack multiple cars into a multiple squads into a car, and then just drop some people off. The middle of the blocks over here. Okay, some people. Um, you know, again, we'll assume they're friendly, although if this is fixed like the last time, they will end up just aggroing against us. Now we're ready to build an antenna. Once it's operational, we'll be ready to receive distant transmissions again. And so we're complaining about full storage over here, but we do have some. So presumably people are going to move stockpiles or okay. just drop things somewhere else. What's the repair status? Power, tower's basically fine. You're fine. Uh, oh, I can queue up some new research. So, I think I'm not going to delay. I'm going to go into um, chemistry immediately. Oh, we need three tech to be able to do that. Um, but to get to the point of ammo production... going there. Because once again, we are out. Support. Ready for action. Shoot. Okay, get into the building. The Use the building for cover here. Shoot! 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 Why are you shooting these people? I guess we're gonna fight inside the building. Do you have ammo? Yeah, the guns are all green. Alright. Took their weapons right away. What time is it? Okay, get in the car, and then go home. Roger. are still scouting out. I thought I sent two people out there, but I might have Clear. collected the same quad twice, which is entirely possible. We're on the move. Go home, and you get in the car, and then go home. On my way. But yeah, we got Ready for car. We got minivan. Minivan has more capacity. Oh, that's fantastic. Operator. Anyway, you're gonna go and like cover this building. Yeah, I don't know if the fuel usage stat is listed. So I don't know if it's consistent or not. Oh, we got some more hostile peeps. I think if I'm gonna build an antenna, I'm gonna put it on this side too, because it's wide open, therefore we can cover this. So anyone aggroing on the antenna will come within range of my people defending my HQ. So that seems, like, good to me. We'll upgrade it to Soccer Mom. I have a minivan in real life and I love it. Used minivan. What else do you need? We've got them. There are some infected around here. That's that YouTube money. Buy used minivans. <laughs> Uh, I mean, well, we'll say engage because we're, we're going to fight them when they're within vision range. I don't know if those buttons do anything other than the flavor. Infected incoming. Yeah, I'm wondering, like, do you just tear down all the buildings around and make a solo compound somewhere just for max sight lines? They're breaking into our building. They're gone. Okay, 2 a.m. There might be some more hordes here, so we're going to wait a little bit longer before we send our troops out. 4 a.m. I don't think we're going to get attacked again. I know he said horde right incoming, but... I do think we're going to send a group out to go and storm this building here of hostels. Another one incoming! Operator, reporting. And that's exactly what's going to happen right now. Yeah, 5 o'clock, yeah. The, the hordes are definitely just... 
going to sleep. Yeah, they're there, but they're gonna yeah, they're gonna back off and go into a building. So we get shot on the way there. We lost a person, so we can't attack these guys from the streets, but they can attack us from the streets. Operator, going there. Oi. Tech building needs love, does it? And I took a little bit, actually, a fair amount of damage. You're right. All right, let's go ahead and pick up a repair. There are zombies in this building. Stand still to shoot? What do you think? Scavenging in the building so you can shoot outside? Maybe. I don't know if there's a way, because this keeps complaining about the, um, the capacity. I don't know if there's a way to, like, move something from one to the other. Waiting orders. Reporting. Reporting. On my way. Let's go ahead and hit these zombies during the day. Construction ready. And then after you're done, we'll hit a bunch of these buildings up. Yeah, we're short one person in the squad. I think that's going to be okay. I could have thrown, I could have just fired one of our builders and put it in there. I think this is going to be okay right now, although it might impact how much they can carry. The place is adapted. Infected in. Inside. Sir, the winter is coming. The days will be shorter. The farms won't produce any Building more clear. food. We should brace ourselves. This might be the hardest thing. You guys are bringing back orders. a lot of stuff. Let's prepare for winter. Ah! I think my squads are coming home. All my civilians are being killed. Oh my god. Where the hell did you come from? We finished construction. The citizens are in danger. Get in quick. They're attacking our workers. Oh my god. Our citizens are under attack. Alright, we do have some pretty so let's go ahead and do that. Arg. Receiving. Going there. there. Go grab that building. Ready Get the guns action. out of there. We're on the move. Get the grain from there. Maybe a tower there, or yeah. Or what if we tear down this building and this building? Although tearing down buildings takes a long time. The scavenging takes forever to do. But like we could run a fence through there. I am wondering about tearing down one of these for the sight line. Cause okay, from here we've got that, which doesn't cover this. Could I, if I went and put a tower right here, we could sort of guard this gap and then anyone who wants to melee would do that. But well, that's actually not bad for the area. I guess maybe we can partially shoot over the buildings. And anyone mailing this tower would get covered from the HQ. Yeah, we do need to make a wall and make the zombies pay for it. Receiving. Maybe I'm overdoing it with squads. That's also possible. Roger. Reporting. Roger. Going there. We'll drop off these resources. I think we throw some people into these cars too. You get into a car way. and we'll get you to do something. Uh, go here and pick up more research, actually. Waiting orders. Drop all that stuff off at the HQ, so we're gonna have lots of extra guns for these towers. Use the tower to block the gap. That's an interesting question, I don't know the answer. Oh, I don't think they could drop it off because it's full. That's... annoying. Going there. So I would tell you to go here to be able to drop off all these guns? I wonder, can we convince people to, like, move things from one building to another? Orders. I'm guessing it's just a civilian. The problem is our squads always want to move things here because they just go to the HQ. Going there. The civilian. I wonder if the civilians just go to the closest one as well, which... Hmm. Reporting. We don't need pull, pills we don't need. I know it's a long-ass hike. But get all the way over there and pick up this extra car. Operator. Yeah, I mean, do I really need these guys to drive anywhere? 
Might want to get them to pick up the um, clear. the ammo and the tools from this building. That might be something. Um, chemistry. Oh, I still need the tech, which theoretically is being collected now. Yes, no? Going there. Operator. My way. Oh, yeah, you've got one. Um, you may as well loot from another building while you're here. We spent all this time getting a car out in this area. Just drive somewhere far with a car just to see where Receiving. what's where. We're on the move. Just to open up some vision? I mean, maybe. And get some more fuel. Uh, hang on, there's a gun place. It's probably ammo. Go but I'm wondering if we come here, does it expose these question marks? I don't think it does. No. Waiting orders. You're waiting for metal. Do we have metal? We do. Oh, let's max out our builders, please. Building clear. Okay, we got all our fields, so we do have farmers going. Uh, we only have half of the ones assigned that we need to. Um, let me drop the scavengers for a sec, max out the builders, max out the farmers, then... Chief, many of our workers don't have any... Yeah, no, I know, I'm trying to sign in the jobs, but I can't because you've got a UI blocking dialogue box. There we go. I just want to send them back to scavenging now. Ready for action. Going there. On my way. Loot another building. I want to, like, chain click these, but then sometimes they walk home without using the car. So that's a little inconsistent. That's a lot of ammo. Uh, what time is it? Eh, you can scavenge one more building. And then we'll send you back. These should go pretty quick. The squad is still trying to get to this car. I think they'll be okay. We could always have them hold up in one of these buildings overnight, but then I'd be worried about defending our house, you know? Building clear. There you go. Building clear, get in the car, and go back to base. Operator, on my way. Well, actually, Operator. what I'm going to do, just because otherwise you might do weird things, clear. drop off everything manually at this warehouse. Maybe that's the way to do things. Receiving. You're over here. Same thing. I'm going to get you to drop everything over at this warehouse. And then... Final squad here. We're supposed to claim this car, please. Going there. Or can we not? Is it busted? Oh, there we go. They got a prog progress bar. Excellent. Return to base. Ready for action. Going there. We're on the move. On my way. Three workers are east to the car. Roger. Roger. Three workers? We're on the move. Are there? On my way. On my way. <laughs> we're dumping the car, so we're getting the messages over and over. On my way. Operator. On my way. Ready for action. We're on the move. We're piling to the HQ. Eight o'clock at night. Expecting hordes soon. Got lots of cars. I think you need bigger place. Yeah, so last time, um, so here we didn't get to choose our HQ. Now, there is a bouton. I wonder if we can tear down the HQ. Let's repair. Yeah, I don't know if there's an option. Like, I haven't seen it, but it'd be great to move the HQ to somewhere bigger. When we were doing our the hometown start, we were in a bigger area. In fact, next time I'll probably just grab the mall. Inbound. If they go and attack here, what we'll have to do is pop out for a second to draw aggro. The drag and drop from the inventory of the HQ to the warehouse. That's an interesting question. No, I can't drag these resources at all. Yeah, so that's happening. That's and that's kind of what it's waiting orders. Receive it, operator. Pop out for a sec. There you go. Draws aggro. Pop back in. Good. There are some infected around here. There are some infected, but I think they're about to go to sleep. Infection clear. I'm kind of worried about them getting into this building, which would have been poor. All right, let's just go walk mode in these areas. 
Rise and grind, people. No time to waste. Building clear. We got our three research now, thank you. So we can start on our chemistry research. Although we don't have any workers assigned here because we didn't need it. I'm going to pull a couple of scavengers off, move them over there and that. So yeah, we are a little lower on scavengers now than we were. But maybe it's okay. Time to not build the wall. Building clear. We're on the move. At some point, do I, am I like, Waiting you know orders. what? We can disband these squads and just get some extra workers. I mean, do I really need to pop more buildings right now? We're kind of good on everything. You know, maybe. We can always regroup them at night. Maybe I'll keep one active squad. Although I would like to change you to use the assault rifle. Although maybe we save the assault rifle ammo for later. Just one squad slowly exploring. I don't think I can put multiple squads in one vehicle. Construction ready. You like the idea. All right. So now we've got some idlers. And I actually don't currently have any jobs. Now someone come up with an interesting idea. Finish dismantling this building. Oh, this, right. Um, hang on. Well, that is... I think that's slightly annoying. I can't click on this building anymore. So that was the case before. When we started dismantling a building, we couldn't actually click on the building anymore, but we could hit the, um, we could hit the button that controls the deconstruct. Like, let's say we tear down this building. In theory that, like, we might want to clear some sight lines over here, right? Set a deconstruct. Right now, I can still click on this building, but once it starts to get teared, torn down, the building can't be clicked anymore, and therefore I can't start the salvaging. So, I mean, I assume that's something that's going to be fixed later, but for now, that's actually kind of a little annoying. Clear. Um, let's go make... We need to make our cookhouse. So I'm gonna make this building into a cookhouse. Uh, and is that too many workers? 11 people in there seems... Well, we don't have to fill it up. I guess we'll go in and get it started. Once this antenna gets built, we can go and ask for some more people to join us, which we'll probably do. Yes, we can't click anymore because we stopped the job. That's exactly what I was saying, sure. The problem is the building became unclickable at some point. At some point during the salvage, the building's unclickable. You could still click on the icon, but that's it. And I didn't, I didn't realize that canceling the job would leave the building in this unclickable state. That's something I think they will have to fix. Reload help? I well, we could try. I, I will just, I'm not going to worry about it. This building's not actually being a problem for us. Done. Not even worried about it blocking sight lines or anything of the sort. Chief, the antenna. Yeah, the antenna's up. I know. Thank you. Okay. Let's start broadcasting. I want to, but you're not letting me click. Game. To all survivors. There we go. This is an infection-free zone. We provide food and shelter, safety and security. Join us. Receiving. Yep, we're going to invite more people. We're going to dramatically increase our population. Where are I'm sure this is going to be fine. They won't be hostile. Oh, we got to come. Whoa! Try to come to us. That's very far away. No offense, but yeah, you, you got to make your own way there. That's how you're going to prove that you're worthy of uh, being part of our squad here. All right, I'll go and create another squad. We do have the excess people. We're on the move. In the car. Um, I don't, although I don't know where to go. We had a research place confirmed. Wow, there's a pickup truck over there. Oh, there's there's a research spot. Head over there. Although it is nearly nighttime. Yeah, probably fine, though. That only leaves me one one squad to defend. Heard you have a car. 
Yeah, but I don't know if I can pick them up. You split a squad and bring both vehicles home. I, Time to sleep, everyone. I guess I could. Tomorrow's another day. But we haven't. I think we have enough vehicles right now. I'm not concerned with picking up more vehicles. I think I'm fine on that part. Reporting. Oh, there you go. I'm full way. of stuff. Just come home right now. It's gonna be fine. Actually, again, I'll tell you to go Receiving. drop off in the We're warehouse. I mean, it's realistic that the storage isn't uh, linked, although part of me kind of wishes, like, maybe it would be. Just for more convenient gameplay. Oh, the talk dogs! Hostiles inbound. Hostiles inbound. Reporting. Yeah, that's you. No squad, only halfway done. Oh, that incoming. is a lot of baddies. Operator. We're on the move. The door won't hold much longer. Inside, quick. We need backup. Yeah, you do definitely take a lot of damage being outside. I wonder if the building, which is getting quite low in terms of health, if at some point it doesn't provide realistic defense anymore. Oh my god, kill them faster. Kill them faster. Oh, we're gonna lose our- we're gonna lose this building! Pair activated. Well, I bet you we don't get attacked here anymore. We're on the move. Fort spotted. Snowing in October in UK, we don't even get snow in December. Most of the yeah, so I guess the weather is uh, generic and not based on where you are necessarily. There are some infected around here. Oh, are you guys done? You're back in your car. Anyway, drive home. Let's see what happens. You actually run over the infected hordes? We'll probably take some vehicle damage. They're coming towards us! Can you shoot out the windows? They're coming towards us! Oh no, they just flow around. Looks like we didn't actually hit them. Like Project Zomboid, I love running over the zombies with the cars. It's really not good for the cars and often spells your, your death as well. But it is really enjoyable. I don't think the resources are gone. They're still... They were still listed in buildings until I initiated the repair. Now I don't know. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to go and raid this building here. And then I might dismantle some of the squads again to get some extra workers. Oh, wrong building, I guess. East one. Going there. We're not alone here. Hey. Sir, we found something interesting near the lair that we just cleared. A CCTV camera, still operational, solar powered. Oh. Could someone still be watching this place? Say hello. Say hello and wave. We can make new friends. Ready for action. Reporting. Disband our squads again. Get more workers, because it looks like we can maybe make them on demand. We'll want them at night. Builders, uh, we'll need some extra jobs for them right now. There are zombies known over there, but that's fine. Okay, I think I'm gonna... I think I might just deconstruct this building. Plus seven unemployed. Maybe a little more construction. I think I'll deconstruct this building too. And let's consider our big giant wall here. Let's start with Metal Gate. And then maybe just wooden palisade. Okay, it definitely snaps the gate, which is nice. 
Doesn't snap to the buildings, but there we go. Building repurposed. The road is missing. Yeah, we still have all our resources in the warehouse. Perfect. Okay. Task complete. Woo! I'm stressed. Are you stressed? I'm stressed. Start working on the nitrocellulose powder. Although we have a good amount of ammo. So yeah, ammo has been, I mean, we did just tear apart our squad, so that's part of it. But I think we've been getting ammo a little bit more steadily in this game. Need a tower near Palestine. Yeah, maybe, but I think that the, uh, I think we can we can station the um, the gate. I'm not sure, but I think we might be able to put people on it, which is why, so we've got a visionary on the gate. I bet you we can put people on here. It's like a pair of towers, which will cover, okay, it actually won't cover this end. We'll see. Oh, the people have arrived. Hey, they made it. They didn't die. Okay, more construction. The whole parking lot. And yeah, tearing down some buildings over here for resources. That should be fine. Bring that down for resources as well. That's going to be okay. And then we might just fence. The place is adapted. Building adapted. Oh, is this a cookhouse? Okay, grain plus wood equals soup. Oh, for fire. I'm like, we're going to eat the wood, but yeah. Or meat, but we don't have a source of meat right now. 11 workers seems like a lot. Although we don't have anyone needed for anything currently. Well, I can start more construction, although I kind of think that what we might need is more scavenging. Yeah. There you go. Ten workers have gone there. They're going to help tear this building down as well. And then, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll plan on running a fence through here. How much grain do you have? Um, three. So... I think what we're doing is we're going to leave one worker set up in here. We'll max you out, and then we'll plan on deconstructing this. There we go. Oh, actually, we need to get some squads active. Okay, everyone's back home right now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cancel. You're not building. You're not scavenging right now anyway. Ready for action. Receiving. Waiting Three squads built. Reporting. Ready for action. I'm going to get you two in there. Again, we're going to leave one in the headquarters, and then we've got the towers to cover this area, so it'll be a doubled up in there. I don't know if you'll have the ability to shoot over the palisades. It looks like you can. That's good. There you go, zombie horde coming. Being engaged. Oh shit, that's tons of things. Um, do I have enough weapons? I do. Let's create another squad over here. Oh, I thought you had enough weapons. Maybe they're still being allocated, or maybe they were in here. Ah, they're in here! Hmm. I mean, one person in this still has guns. Eliminated. The towers need to be garrisoned, but they are. We have we have workers, uh, the guard job over there. Yeah, you're on pistol mode, which honestly might not be a problem. I don't know, we'll put you on arrow mode after this. Reporting. I'll go and move you into this building. Say, some of the horde will come this way, so let me back up and do this. There you go, just pull some of you off temporarily. Okay, put you back. We'll do a little dance with the horde. Actually, I guess if I set you here, you'll start shooting once you're still. There you go. Good. What I really want to do is throw you into this building right now, because actually, the this might be the better building. Yeah, it doesn't cover all of the warehouse, but it will cover all this internal stuff, which is great. What time is it? 8 p.m. Oh my god, that's early in the night. Oh no. There's tons more is going to come. On my way. I wonder if I tell the... Hold on. If I tell this squad to come over here, you go You go into the HQ. I wonder if they're going to pick up guns from the warehouse. Huh? They do. Okay, good. Reporting. On my way. Yeah, we might want to put you in different buildings just for slightly different overlaps. PM. It's 10 p.m. Do you know where your zombie children are? Midnight. Another one incoming. The infected are pillaging a building. Hostiles inbound. 
Yeah, you have a fire angle. This one doesn't, so I do think I'm going to throw in here so that you guys can contribute. Everyone who comes in here, all these buildings cover the central thing. I guess I could use these buildings to cover the north angles, or we tear them down. Squad's gaining experience. Yeah, they do. So, um, so this one is leveled experience. This little chevron makes me think that's a rank. That might not be... Um, that might not be implemented yet. Again, we're on like super early alpha build. But you can see here, experience, they are actually getting some stats. Port, spotted. We've got them. You could potentially get attacked one more before the night ends. Buzzing around down there. Yeah, I think they're just settling in for the night. So. I don't know if this is bad for the experience, but I'm going to disband the squads again to get some extra daytime workers. It seems like it works pretty well. Uh, builders, lots of scavengers. Okay. And go, go. When's the day break? Go. I guess time of year it is. It really is later. All right, everyone's heading out. Lots of tearing down buildings. Research just completed. Um, I think I'll probably just get rid of the researchers for now. Throw some more scavengers in. That looks good. Yeah, body disposal feels like it should be something. We should have a burn pit. Growling collar. Oh, this seems great. Doesn't it? This seems fine. Yeah, that's a good question. What we'll do is we'll rebuild the squad and see if it picks up experienced members. Do you need help? Yeah, all right, we'll just switch channel. We'll have to go and check that out, but I would expect a fight. Right now, I think we need to get our defenses up, so I'm actually okay with just running things. Oh yeah, see guards, do show up over here, okay. I should have put the gate a little bit more centralized. I think that there's a blank spot, but I suspect it's probably fairly unlikely that something ends up chewing that specifically. Um, especially with the path, and they'll almost certainly enter a kill zone over here. Um, and yeah, go ahead and get your weapons. I won't uh, unassign you or anything like that. And good, all the builders went over to scavenging, which is okay. We need the material, but we also kind of need these, some of these buildings out of the way. But yeah, that seems like it's really quite nice with this passive defense. I like seeing the doors like flick open. No research, correct. Sign farmers net. Don't we have? We have, uh, yeah, we have six farmers. Yeah, we have six farmers established, one person in food prep. So theoretically our grain count is gonna increase faster than you know, we'll use it necessarily, but that's not necessarily the end of the world. I'm still, I think I'm still happy with focusing on some of the scavenging right now. Winter is coming. Well, winter is here. Work's done. Head back to your shelter. And they not plant at all in winter? Like, is it possible? I think it just said the production was going to go lower in the winter. Resources slash capacity. But yeah, that's an early midnight. Okay, winter does suck. So, since no one's working again, what we'll do is we'll cancel all the scavengers. And yeah, if I go and create a new squad, they do... I think it is prioritizing the ones with experience. So that's good. Now, theoretically, this side's a little bit more protected because of this. We could throw some extra people in the stockpile because it'll still cover some of the fencing. And you're out of guns, so I will send you over here to go and presumably pick up some guns that are there. Oh, we, just, oh, we might not have enough because they've all been taken by the gate. Okay, I'll send you over there anyway. And yeah, otherwise I think all in the HQ side is going to be fine. Yeah, these long nights in winter, these are brutal. It does feel like it's going a lot better than our first game. Now, part of it is almost certainly going to be a lot of experience. Right, if we went back to our uh, hometown there, 
I suspect we'd be able to do a little bit stronger. Both of these are covering the tower from the melee, although the, almost certainly the tower is taking a little bit of damage. Not much to talk about, though. Oh, do you have modes? I could put you bow and arrow as well here, too, but I really want to make sure this stays up, so I will go and deploy the pistols. The towers being on bow and arrow mode seem fine, plus now we don't have enough guns. Okay. Might feel a little more satisfying to fight off the horde if there's a chance of them dropping random stuff, but I don't know. Like, what would they drop? Like, would they be carrying food? Oh, that's not great. Waiting orders. We're on the move. Receiving. Roger. We don't have a line of sight. Okay, they were pulled Roger. over here because we left the building, and now they're going to do that. But okay, we are planning on like, yeah, fencing all this up. What time is it? One o'clock. Okay. Don't think we'll get another horde attack before the start of the day, okay? Although, if I'm not sending my squads out to somewhere, that's fine. We're getting a little low on food. Ready for action. I'm gonna keep a little, a couple of squads here. Operator. You two, Reporting. come over here. We'll see about picking up some canned food. We do, we do have a reason to like send people out again. We know about canned food over there. Also, some um, another group of survivors over there. Another one incoming. Yeah, not really though, because it's daytime. Clear. You saw Horde for a second, but you're okay. Go back to scavenge mode with more people. Ooh, can zombies go through empty buildings. Um, they can enter empty buildings during the day, but I don't think they crawl through them. I think we're probably okay to keep them on the fence. I guess we could send these squads over to some of the, the buildings. This is operator of infection free zone. State your business. Finally. Day 10, same in the other map. And yeah, feel much better. It's such a nice day outside. Who the hell are you? Sleep. I think I'll go to that house by the end of the road today. It's clear. I think I'll go to the house at the end of the road. Um, who are you? I'm sorry. Who are you? Uh, I can't you I. Let me pause. Funny. Very funny. <laughs> you almost had me. You know, I really appreciate our little talks. Some of these radios are really low. I'm, I'm sorry, I don't know you. Talked yesterday before, I know your voice. I'm not Gary. And then who are you? Yeah, join. Join us. I think you're probably crazy, but. We have a. Join us. I haven't been in a house. What's your address? Where? Sainsbury's. You're in Sainsbury's? Hey! Alright, we're sending a squad. Again. Thank you. I got a treat stream! We haven't gotten one in the while. A classic Poutine! See, we should be back on the Sudbury map now. Oh man! Thank you! I'm gonna get these squads to drop off their gear. We'll get them in cars. We'll go and check out some of these sites. I'm s Let me just refresh here. Okay, it did only come through once. I'm like, hang on, did we get the pop-up twice? But no, 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 my, my log in treat stream only shows one. I think we just accidentally got the alert twice. That's awesome. I haven't had puts in in so long because I haven't ordered one. I haven't ordered one since last time we got one tree stream and it has been some time there. Yeah, part of it seems, it seems okay. We'll double check. We'll double check on that. I mean, worst comes to worse. Uh, I'm sure we can figure out a way to rewind that or undo something or whatever, but it looks like it just came through once. It was just a double pop-up. We'll, we'll make, we'll make sure on both our ends. Okay, squads have deployed. Good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw both squads into a vehicle. Going there. Um, oh, it clicked on the notification, which isn't what I was looking for. Operator. It's like, why did it pan me over here? Again. I'm hoping that they will add hotkeys for the squads. Again, they may already exist, but I couldn't find a button for it. I couldn't find the bouton. Speaking of uh, pronouncing things correctly there, Canuck TW. Ah! I see why, yeah, yes. Operator, ready for action. So this was the growling house. But if I got two squads, let's let's send them in. 
Okay, way. both squads go. Let's clear the growling house. I'm sure it's fine. What could possibly go wrong? I was wondering if both cars go at the same speed. It appears they do. Normal for houses around the UK. Oh, maybe the, maybe the minivan's a little slower. Yeah, they, sometimes they have trouble finding a parking spot. Infected inside. I'm shocked. Shocked to hear. Get out of the car. That the house is infected. infected inside. All right. Both squads still have maximum health. There you go. We'll let I'll let them finish the scavenging. I'm hoping there's some like bonus interesting stuff there since it is a growling house. I do wonder if I should send some people here. You're badly hurt. Like just just come and join. We got medicine. We're good. Building clear. Receiving. All right. I'm on my way. What would also be nice is if there was a button to tell them to like Get back into the nearest car. Because, yeah, I think you're just sitting there. Going there. Get into the nearest car. Thank you. Now, select both of these guys. And now we're going to go to way over here. The caller with the hallucinations over in the same. I like it's a market. Like, so they know from the um, from the mapping software, like they know the name of the place. And presumably they also have like tags for like type of business. So they know the, Sa the Sainsbury is like, you know, a little, a little super, a super marché. We want to be fancy. And by fancy, I mean incorrectly pronouncing some French. Because apparently that's what I consider to be fancy. <laughs> Which makes no sense, because I actually get really frustrated when people do bad French pronunciations unironically. No room in the stock room. That's the other thing, too. It's like, I don't know if there's a good way to, like, shuffle things over to an emptier stock room. Feels a little awkward there. Boss, we found the guy, but he's a bit weird. <laughs> no. Are you sure we want him? Our citizens might get a bit concerned. No, of course, we can accept him. He's crazy, that's fine. Take him. Every life matters. And walk on his own. We are going to investigate the site. Because we're here, why not? It's chat. This person here is Twitch chat. Personified. See, one person went immediately back to the car and the other didn't. Now, it might be a little weird because we had the, the double up on um, workers. What time is it? Four o'clock. You know what? You can probably scavenge another nearby building. Or we'll have you guys double up on this. Maybe you went because they were full of resources and then dropped it off. Yeah, we'll do a quick double one. How does Las Vegas look generic building? That's interesting. I bet you it is. I bet you they don't have landmarks, but they could they could implement it automatically for some. So now both of them went to the car. It must have to do with what they're carrying. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell both these guys to explicitly drop off their stuff in the warehouse. Just because space is a thing. We're coming up on the end of day. It's January. The nights are still going to be long. The days are going to be short. Oh, did we get another assault rifle? Nice. Um, let's go and reassign two new squads. Receiving. Reporting. We're on the move. Waiting orders. We're on the move. In that building, because we know that angle is bad, and then we can put the other two when they show up over in here. The guys to the south might be extra people. Yeah, I mean, there's two people in there who are injured. We could just send a squad in. Reporting. Going there. They're injured. There's only two. Even if they're hostile, we can I'm almost certainly take them without too much trouble. Ready for action. Good. We're on the move. And you're gonna work to empty your car. Excellent. On my way. I'll probably Waiting tell orders. you to do the other car too. We're on the move. Roger. Roger. We spare the ammo. We actually are pretty good on ammo on right now. Ooh, another transmission. Sir, we've encountered a group of people oh, over here. willing to join us. Yeah, no. Send them in. Good, Report. okay. On my way. They'll probably stay there at night. Can I get you to go Going into there. the other car? Um, leave this car, enter this car, because there's still some stuff to loot. Pick that stuff up. Drop it off in here. There we go. So we get the extra assault rifles and everything sorted out. Good. Everyone's in a building, although yeah, I'll take one of you guys out and put you over here. Okay. Kick up the speed. Wait for the Zambies. 
going there. Oh, there we go. Coming into this gate. We're hoping is that this will survive this onslaught. Again, these guys here theoretically can help with the shooting. It looks like to me. Looks like they have line of sight. Yeah, I can see the bullets occasionally go, which is great. Some extra cover. We'll have to repair that afterwards, but overall not too shabby. They're gone. Did we finish our research on nitrocell? Yeah, we did. You know what? Actually, oh, we need five to start making our own guns. Okay. But we can set up a, a workshop to build ammo. We convert these buildings to it. And then in case this, that's probably the plan. Zombies ran away. Oh, no, they're just pathing to a different direction. Excellent. No clock. We might still get hoarded some more, so we're just going to sit tight. I thought that was a zombie. Just a bird. Oriam, I think we're good. Do we want to send our squads out anywhere? How's our food? Yeah, we might want to go and... Ready for action. Receive it. Ready for action. Oh, Operator. there's a horde there. I'll tell you what, I'll send everyone into this building. And then we'll shoot the zombies. These zombies might just be going to that gate. Oop, hang on. On my way. Thought we'd make it to the building first, but we didn't. There we go. Order now we're fine. In. Going there. Let's clear out this little block. When daytime comes, I'm expecting these survivors to go and run into our base. Everybody get ready. Yep, there they go. Perfect. For an alpha pretty entertaining. No, I was shocked. Because a lot of times I don't do a lot of the early access games because it's like, it feels like such an incomplete um, experience. Clear. But in this case, yeah, it's working out great. Operator, we found an abandoned farmstead. There are some chickens running around. They seem to have gone wild, but... Maybe we can breed them if we make a proper place for that. Yeah. That's them. We'll All right, we'll take shot. some chickens. Clear. Roger. Over there, I might still want to disband some of these guys to uh, contribute to the scavenging efforts. Again, we want the material, but we also just want these buildings to be out of the way. a little gate in there. Maybe we just fence this area. Leave this building up. No, I kind of think I'm going to tear this down, although we've got we've got a lot of buildings we're waiting to have to tear down here. Going there. Waiting orders. I don't know if there's a good way. It'd be nice to have one squad with just the um, assault rifles. They're fishing. Oh, it'd be great if there was fishing in the game. You're right. Clear. Oh, who are you? Receiving. Going there. Just a lone survivor. Oh, this might be the crazy guy. He was probably hunkered in, um, in a house at night. Yeah. Going there. And then you are you are a group of six. Hold on. Operator. Waiting orders. Just in case something Going goes there. wacky here. Morning. Roger. We're on the boat. Building clear. Unless these are people we called in. Sir, we've encountered a group of people willing to join us. I accept. Send them in. Okay. All right, this quad with no AK. I'm going to dismantle you. More scavengers. On my way. Okay. Ready for You're action. idle there. There's tons of food just, like, chilling out over here. Um, actually, get in a... Get in one of the combos here. I guess we have two sedans and then one sort of state wagon, minivan kind of thing. Mood is dissatisfied. Oh, it is. A weird person was accepted into the, D the zone. Oh, wow. Oh, no. How are we doing on grain? Okay, that's going up. So we will go and get some more people cooking because I'm assuming these cooked meals are probably better than the canned food in terms of keeping people happy. Maybe it doesn't make a difference. Reporting. Reporting. Roger. I think if I bulk queue here, I'm not sure that they're going to unload things into the car. Roger. 
No, see, they just grabbed it. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. Brother Beard, are you, are you the weirdo? So I think if I manually do this, you'll go, you'll unload into the car, you'll get back into the car. This driving is hilarious, though. We're on the move. And then if I do this, no, you probably still won't, huh? I guess I can do this and then queue up, go back to the car. Well, maybe the best thing to do is get in the car, then drive the car over here. And then do a little bit. Maybe that'll be the way to do it. I just don't want a situation where they finish looting and then they just walk home Roger. instead of doing anything else. All right. Uh, these two squads. Are you a pure pistol squad? You are. So I'm going to tell you to disband yourself. Maybe I'll keep the assault rifle squad here. If I go, the hospital has no assault rifle. Does the HQ have assault rifles? No. Yeah, I guess we just don't have that. Oh, well, maybe we can stock up a little bit. On my way. Let's do that. <laughs> Rip donuts to boost morale. I like that. Oh, look at this. Lunch counters. Okay, so I want to go and increase the food prep. Let's have five people working on food prep now. We'll just keep an eye out on our raw food situation. Okay, you're in scavenging mode. Good. Okay, buildings are starting to go away. So yeah, we need fewer scavenger nouns. Buildings clear. So I think I want these buildings for some of my workshops. They can fit a lot of things. They are pretty large, but I think I'm going to build the fence here. I guess we could plan that now. So I want another gate. And there you go. Cover all the way up to the wall where those buildings are, which might stay for now. The plan is going to be put you down. They don't see currently they don't seem to focus on attacking the fence. They get pulled to where the gunfire is coming from. Now this one might be a little different. That actually might be a good candidate for a metal fence here. And maybe we'll put a little tower right behind it. Stop working. Start winding down for some rest. Okay, at the end of the day, we're not gonna start any construction right now. That's fine. Um, see, this squad's back in the car. I think you can go and investigate one more location here. And then we'll send you back to base. And then the other squad, right, was down here. Building clear. Um, you think you have enough time. You're going to do this building, and then I'm going to tell you to come back to our warehouse in the old hospital. Operator, going there. Whee! Building clear. And right, and what we can also do... Can't start a squad from here, huh? Let's do the same thing where we fire all our scavengers and then Receiving. make a couple of new squads. Operator. On my way. Reporting. On my way. We'll get them in these buildings clear. for now. Building clear. Idlers, well, they'll just be scavengers when the day comes back. Or builders, perhaps. Builders first, then scavengers, assuming we have the material. Um, yeah, just drive back, buddy. Okay. What day are we on? Day 11. Roger. Oh. There are some infected around. Waiting orders. We're on the move. Actually, I'm going to get you to go into this building. Reporting. We're on the move. Infected incoming. I'm gonna like, yeah, Ooh, that is a lot coming from the south. Ready for action. We're on the Woo-wee! No ammo. You are helping some. Operator. Reporting. Get into this HQ, because you'll cover that. Uh, I think you're out of ammo, aren't you? I guess that's one of the good reasons to... So you're fine. There you go. Pull you over. But defending from the warehouse or from the HQ means we've got a constant supply of ammo. So these guys are completely out of ammo. So we'll do that. Okay. That is something to consider. Port spotted! Yeah, I don't know... Oops, wrong... 
Oh, we do have the ability to convert a building into a barn. Adapt to barn. That seems like a pretty good idea. Here, we'll plan on that. Okay, what time is it? Okay, I think the horde's timing is gone now, which is good. So the two bottommost squads, I'm gonna disband you. And how are we on building material? Some, I think Rising I'll mostly coming. put you on scavenging for now. If the path is blocked. So we know there's some hordes hiding in that building. Let's get way. these two squads to just assemble and go in together. We're on the move. Out of the pocket. Chief. I'm in this place of something odd about it. Someone must have been here recently. Get on ground, drop your weapons. What's going on? What's going on? Another squad in here. Oh, we lost nice tower. Nice little squad you got here. And it's gonna have to be okay. Very, very nice. Who are you? Who are you? Oh, uh, you know, just a humble man living his earning on the road. Uh, let me talk to your leader. I want to speak to the leader. It's then Negan. You're in luck. Never really watched Walking this Dead. Would be me. Watched first season and a half or so. I read I read a bunch of the uh, graphic novels though. All right, what do you want? What do you want? I don't know. What can you offer for your people's lives? Don't be a jerk. Just come and join us. You bastard. You bastard. Come on. Be nice to each other. I'm gonna get angry. Um, release them. Oh, am I asking them to release my squad? Oh, did you can? Is that why this one is grayed out? Because this has been captured. You know what? You're gonna pay. You're pay? <laughs> How? I can assemble two more squads. We're gonna kill you. Watched all the good bits of Walking Dead. Don't worry. <laughs> Let's be reasonable. Consider what I'm about to say. You ready? Uh-huh. Say it. Just say it already. This is... Oh my god, just go faster. You're coming here with supplies and quick. You take too long, you people die. You bring any weapons, poof. We let them go. Deal's the deal. Um, well, I mean, we're gonna accept... I mean, do we accept and then still just show up with guns? I mean, yes, totally. Then you open your supply bags and it's just filled with, like, AK and pistols. I'm oh. glad we have an understanding. Later. I think because my other squad is there, I think the fighting started instantly. Receiving. Reporting. Operator. On my way. Hang on. Go Get in the car. Down. I won't believe what happened. One infected just followed us outside into the sun. It's even worse. He seemed to know exactly what he was doing. It took him a moment to give up and return to darkness. Uh, killed that. Better get back there and kill him. We're on the move. Reporting. I tried to right click on a vehicle with two squads to see what would happen. Whoa. I see. And then, like, playing my rules. Come with supplies. Yeah, we're just gonna fight you. You. God damn it, they fooled us! Kill them, boys! Got. I'll get you next time, operator. I'm a smooth operator. All right, it looks like we're fine. Okay, we did lose one person in the squad. I don't think we can replenish here. Oh, you're probably going back to base to replenish. Receiving. Roger. Get into the car. Roger. Waiting orders. Go back going to there. HQ. On my way. Go in there, you're gonna pick up some stuff and go back. Same Operator. thing with you in the car. On my way. Full. Come here. Operator. Go back. Right okay, we've loaded everything. Good. Well, I mean that's not great. But it could have been much worse. On my way. Going there. Roger. On my way. Yeah, we killed some of those guys, maybe took some rifles. Obviously, it also, you know, eliminated our own weapons. Uh, we have no one researching right now. Um, 
And I think, oh no, we're waiting for five research so we can start maybe making guns. I don't know, unless we need a tool factory because I'm actually a little bit worried about running out of tools. Oh, we can improve crop yield with researching farming. I mean, there's still plenty of resources for just, uh, just loot in places. I think I'm gonna research the tool factory first. Replenish, good. Well, again, I think actually we can just get everyone working during the day. Waiting orders. Science happening again. I'm gonna max out the builders right now as long as they're not complaining about lack of resources. We'll do that first. Construction ready. Good. Working on the barn for our chickens. Lots of workers, it's a pretty big barn. Here, how much? Okay, yeah, we see a little health bar, okay. You're kind of fine, you're fine. Eh, you're pretty badly hurt. You're okay. I didn't start a timer with the tin. Wrap it up, folks. Time to call it a day. Now, we probably have some people here. We do. Armed with pistols. That's fine. So we should auto-engage these dumbasses. Thank you very much. And look at that. Suddenly we've got some more pistols. Call it a day. So what we'll do is we'll cancel the scavengers. Um, and I suppose the builders. Squad one. Two. Receiving. At least three. I send one squad out there to pick up this stuff. Full AK squad, or M15 squad, or whatever this is supposed to be. Some sort of uh, assault rifle. On my way. On my way. Ready for action. Okay. Receiving. Armed. You Ready picked up action. that stuff, which is great. Um, I guess just go back to the HQ for now. I'll send someone else over here. Okay. Yeah, this tower here did get destroyed. We'll have to maybe just pop units out to cause them to run for me. There Good. 10 p.m. Ooh, that is a big horde there, but we've got some overlapping firing arcs. Oh, we did lose some fencing. Got them. Okay, health there is still fine. Some there, we did get someone to chew through the fence on their way here. All right, I think that's it for that. It does start to feel safer and safer to keep an active squad. Operator. We'll uh, leave this one here with the full AK where it is. I mean, we might send you out into the field, but what I mean is uh, we'll keep you intact right now in case we need something to quickly respond, whatever might happen. Let's rip down some buildings, do some farming. How is our food situation? Okay, we are burning, th burning through the grain now. So I think what I'll do is I'll bring down the uh, cookhouse staff ever so slightly. There we go, do some of that. And yeah, I guess these little rings show health bars. Uh, it's a little harder to see on these fences, but overall we seem okay. Um, you know, it's probably worth doing a quick repair job on this metal gate right now. Better safe than sorry. Building repurposed. Building repurposed. Good, some scavenging is finishing. <laughs> this is over. Oh. Who are you? Who are you? Are you the jerk? Realize you're all gonna die, you're gonna die. Oh, it's the crazy person. Hey. We saw that last time. Building complete. Listen, calm down, sir. Get off our comms. Yep. I'm just gonna ignore you. I don't need that kind of, like, negativity. Uh, yeah, there we go. Max out builders. 
Our worker has no way. Worker has no way. I don't know what that means. Oh, but we are done this. Um, I think I probably will scavenge this building. Research complete. Little factory research complete. So, I kind of think that this might be... I guess we still don't have the arms factory, although currently ammo is okay. Tools factory that. Maybe we'll plan an arms factoring this thing. Although... This is killing line of sight from this building, but we're going to fence all this anyway. So no, I think that's going to be okay, actually. Okay. I think our fences are okay. Uh, one of them had a little bit of hit point damage right over there, but it's barely so. Time to sleep, everyone. Tomorrow's another day. It's not long enough. Ready for action. Waiting orders. Reporting. Reporting. You don't have any more guns, so going I'm going to send you over there with the assumption that there's probably more guns sitting in this building. Yeah, one. That's still going to be okay. All right, here we go. I haven't sent any squads out to any buildings for a while, but I think that's fine. Got some cooked meals. Yeah, we did lose this fence over here. It, got, it did get destroyed. Port, port eliminated. You, okay, so we don't have any extra cover for that Receiving. building, which I don't love. We're on the move. Let me send... Oh, that pathing is awkward. Oh, but we do have an angle from here, which is good. Get in this building. There you go. Give some extra cover to this gate. And then as these zombies come around, they engage more things. No, this is fine. Port eliminated. Action cleared. I wonder if I should uh, radio and we can invite some more people. I think Call I will. Survivors. This is an infection-free zone. We provide should probably hit that button a little more aggressively, actually. Okay, I think we're done our raids. Operator. Reporting. Okay. Dismantle and... Scavenge build. The work ain't gonna wait for us. We're running out of resources. Out of wood. Well, I mean, we're gonna get some from dismantling here, although maybe not as much as I'd like. We do have some trees over here. I think I will reestablish a wood gathering zone, specifically. I guess I don't need the guards currently, although, well, I say that. See, every now and again, now we're getting these random hostiles during the day. And apparently there's a hint that there might be hostile zombies that happen as well. These guys here that are going to work the trees, some of them are going to be auto-protected, but not necessarily Receiving. all of them. On my way. Well, actually, stay here. You should have a firing angle as soon as these guys come around the corner. Our workers might die. There we go. Now, I'm going to go and pick up these resources with you, but then I can also position some troopers in, say, this building to cover this angle, and that might be a good idea. Yeah, sorry, we're not on the hometown map anymore. This British map, again, I don't know if the British map here is more balanced or if it's just that we, you know, have more experience now, but it certainly feels like it's going a lot better. We're All right, we got ourselves a barn. So we got some workers assigned to it. Um, I don't know if we need quite this many. Well, oh, this turns grain into meat. Oh, interesting. So what I could do is I could change this recipe here. So we'll now make meat into the meals. Yeah. Bring this down to just one. And we'll do this. So we'll convert grain into meat, because one grain into two meat is pretty good. I mean, there's time, obviously, but more and more efficiency. Uh, I hear you. I hear you. Hostile help, need help. I'm sick. Oh, this person! What do you need? Yeah. No, this is... Yeah, were you bitten? They say no, but as soon as we get there, it's still going to be a zombie horde. Yeah, can you come? And I think they're going to say no. All right, where are you? Sure, I'll totally send a squad there. I mean, I am going to send a squad there. A squad that is fully loaded with assault rifles. Roger. Oh. You know what? Just walk over. We're on the move. That is darn close. 
He had good loot. Oh, that's true. He did have good loot. You know what? Maybe I should bring a vehicle after all. Here, I'll grab this one. It's a little closer. Because there was some extra stuff there, so it might, well, in the end, save us transportation time. We also have an arrow over here. I don't know what that's pointing to. It's like a yellow arrow, and then... And then it goes away. Oh. I wonder if at some point, I mean, maybe they'll add something like a maintenance depot or something for doing the auto repairs, so you don't have to keep like finding individual buildings that need repair, unless you want to prioritize something. Something like that might be convenient going forward. Oh, I forgot to shift Q. Squad. Oh. Join us. Okay, good. Whew. Infected incoming. Yeah, you've dealt with the site. That's fine. You know, scavenged it, reached it. Too late. Attacked us. Yep. That's fine. That's but yeah, too bad. You're right. They did have some sweet stuff. We're on the move. On my way. Oh, did you fill up the car already? Oh yeah, you it was a sedan as opposed to the uh the minivan. Going there. Going there. Oh, it's nighttime. Going there. Avengers builders go away. Going there. Squad. 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 And you're short a weapon, but we'll send you into that. You'll also get into this vehicle. Reporting. On my way. Reporting. We're on the move. Cover these northern buildings a bit more. If anything comes from the south, we'll have to respond. So I guess what I'll do is I'll sort of stare in this area. Port eliminated. There are some infected around here. Ah, uh, you're chewing that building, which is kind of annoying. Although if I pop these guys out, yeah, I was gonna say that'll that'll draw them, and then we can finish them off. Good. Good. Whoop. Ready for action. We're on the move. Reporting. On my way. Yeah, let's get you guys into the HQ. Infection clear. That building is down. Yeah, this building got torn down, but I mean, it wasn't at full HP, so... We got them. It was just starting construction. That is a lot of mad dogs. Infection clear. Try to rebuild it. So, if there's nothing... Okay, I think that's probably going to be fine. Um, Operator. disband. Receiving. Waiting orders. Waiting orders. Disband you. Ready and as for, for you, let's go into the actual SUV here, and we'll go and pick up what was left in that building, which isn't much, but then you can also do some scavenging Receiving. in the area. Yeah, one gun, one ammo crate. I mean, that's still nice. The dogs bite the house down. They did. Workers heading out. And then a building, get us some wood, because we definitely need it. Receiving, Chief. We've just encountered some wounded people. They claim to have been attacked by some armed men and escaped afterwards. Um, yeah. We'll Send accept them. them. In. I'm sure it's fine. Waiting orders. Roger. Drop that off into the car. Oh, we got some research up here. Let's do that. Roger. That seems very valuable. The dogs want to get the door from the science lab. Their lab door retrieve. Oh my god. Why are you people so awful? <laughs> yeah, no workers, that's fine. No cooked meals, no grain. Although, yeah, there we go. We do have the meat, so this will start happening a little bit. That's producing. We got the quest done. Clear. Good, you joined us. Excellent. Here, throw in those builders, because theoretically we might have enough material right now. We need more resources. Oh, no bags of grain. Okay, so let's fire you. We do have full farmers. We might need more farming fields. 
is entirely possible. I did change the food recipe. My hat, it's got... Hang on. Oh, it's Q and Q. Okay, so it's good. It's, it wants to finish this food cycle and then it'll switch over there. Okay. I mean, we could accelerate by throwing more people in, I'm sure. Uh, we're not currently researching, are we? Hang on, we don't need our scientists. Throw more people in there to finish that cycle. Start making our meals out of the other stuff. Waiting orders. Squad over here, done. You do have a little bit of tech. Roger. Building clear. On my way. Some more, more well, guns and ammo. I mean, one of the guns and ammo is from there, Building but we can do this. Random gun on floor south of base. Oh yeah, from uh, the last time someone yoloed. We're running out of stock. Into our defenses. Out of fuel canisters. Well, that doesn't feel great. We might need to raid more places with the fuel icon. You're still scavenging. Oh, it is nighttime. Um, you know what? You're gonna go home. Roger. So I don't know if this, like, squad micro is, you know, necessarily intended or perhaps desirable. Oh, this is not built, which is good. Reporting. We're on the move. Receiving. We're on the move. Roger. Waiting orders. Roger. Okay. Position. Port spotted. We're there. So we've got good coverage all around our base. In a small island. That would make life a little easier, right? Wow, weirdly quiet night. There are some infected around here. Weirdly quiet. We're running out of reason. Okay, so we need fuel and that that's why it's complaining about the fuel to make bullets, but All right, that's the end of the uh, night again. Waiting orders. Receiving. Operator. Waiting orders. On my way. Hop in the car. Come here. That's there. petrol station. Excellent. That's exactly what I want. I mean, maybe driving out there feels a little counterproductive. We can drain the cars. I guess that's one of the other things you can do is... I was wondering why they had the car draining option. This is operator of the sixth zone. We're under attack. Building I'm clear. Repeating. We're under attack. Going there. Where's your location? State your location. And we cannot hold them so we can steal water. the cars and then drain the fuel so that we can use it to make bullets. Clear. Um, we're losing you. We're losing you. Oh, uh, this one here. Okay, yeah. We're really just done. Because we, we can't communicate with them. You got plenty of room? You got plenty of room. Let's check another building. Um, I guess I need a squad to go in there. Oh, shoot. We have tons of idle workers. Oh, yeah, the triangulation event. Okay, hold on a sec. You guys are still scooting over here. Oh, let's max out the scout. Oh, maybe I never reassign people to work. That's possible after the night. Another squad. Going there. Get you into this car and we'll empty it. Clear. Receiving. Uh, let's drive to this building and then get into it and hopefully just shoot this guy from a distance. Uh, car. There you go. We need backup. Oh my God! Don't get killed. Oh. We actually did get a rank up over here. Oh, veteran. How come you're not shooting them? This is the same thing that happened last time. Like, sometimes they weirdly don't fire back. This guy's in your kill box. I mean, I don't know. Maybe he's hiding behind this tree. 
But I'm worried we're just going to come out here, walk into the car, get shot some more, and I don't know if they shoot from the car itself. Waiting orders. Or fuel from fuel tank. I'm assuming we can't go any further. this gave us some fuel. There you go, car resources, yeah. On my way. So empty it into this building. Okay. Do the same thing over here. Building clear. We need backup. Receiving. Okay, you killed them. It looks like they did shoot them from the car. Going there. On my way. Let's do that. We got plenty of daylight. We do. Okay. Reporting. Our fuel tank is empty. But then you're refueling it. On my way. There we go. Okay. Now, you're somewhat injured. There's enough time. You know what? You're going to take the hike out of here and pick up this pickup truck. We're on the move. Waiting orders. All right. I like this. Signal's weak over here. We have to search elsewhere. Sure, but you can still scavenge this building. Yeah. Okay. Receiving. That's a long hike out there for that vehicle, but I think it's probably worth doing. Meanwhile, oh, we don't have more scavenging. Um, we can put you on building mode, assuming we got the material for it. And more unemployed, yeah. Um... Let's tear down a bunch of buildings over here. Although we do still mostly need wood. Yeah, or more farmers. Oh, God, I really want to get my walls up, but... 25 builders. Are they all working on this building? They are all working. Meanwhile, my squads... Okay, they're still busy. You're still walking your way over that vehicle. Reporting. You're scavenging this building, which is fine. Speed. Done. Ooh. Food and fuel. All right, don't mind if I do. I haven't said three o'clock in the way. afternoon. You've got... Oh, your vehicle is full. Okay, so tell you what. Just go home then. Meanwhile... Hey, you got to the pickup. Why don't you, while you're here, I'm going there. scavenge this building, and then we'll drive home. Much space. Oh, pick up a truck and fit 20. Okay. That is spacious. People are still working. They just dropped off a bunch of salvage stuff. Clear. Good. Empty there. those vehicles. On my way. We're on the move. Okay, um... On my way. Just set up in this building. Are you full of ammo? You are full of ammo. Good. Yeah, set up over there for that angle. That's going to be fine. Meanwhile, you guys are done there too? Great. Let's drive home. You don't have a full load of stuff. Ow! You know what? Why don't you stop here? This place apparently has some weapons. Master's Lodge. Like a hunting lodge? Let's check that out. Food's super low. So I think we do have to be a little bit more active with our uh, scavenging. Actually, go ahead and pick up those weapons finally. Yeah, and set up more, uh, more farms. But there's still a lot of food just waiting for us Start everywhere. Down for some rest. This gate this gate is fine. This one's fine. A little damage, but barely. Receiving. Receiving. On my way. Go back over there. Still have some spare ammo. Operator. Quad here, nearly done. I guess what I'll do is I'll right click the vehicle, shift right click the vehicle, and then shift right click over here. Clear. Waiting orders. Going there. On my way. Reporting. Roger. 
Operator. Roger. Operator. Okay. Oh, assign someone to the bar. Um. Oh, we did. I guess I got deassigned at some point. We call in more people. To all survivors. I think so. This is an infection-free zone. We provide food and shelter, safety We're and security. Going Join there. Us. On my way. There are some infected around. I mean, maybe I should just be putting out the call during the day. I don't know if it makes a difference. Wow, they are scared to engage. Okay. Another one incoming. Receiving. Going there. Hostiles inbound. You know what? Waiting orders. I'm going there. Here. That's where we're seeing the action is we're on the right hand side right now. There are some infected around here. I don't know. I was gonna say, are we even gonna get attacked tonight? Uh, Took him a while. Okay, I think we're fine now. Um, do I send out a bunch of squads to go and pick up some stuff right now? I think the answer is going to be yes. Receiving, receiving. No, I think we'll do the. Receiving. All right, what's up? Reporting. Ready for action. Reporting. Reporting. Going there. Take care of all these buildings up here. I mean, there. Need help? Kindless in this wandering. Yeah, man. Come. Where are you? Um. I was just gonna say they come to us again. It worked out last time. Building clear. Going there. Oops. On my way. My squads. Didn't realize I had my squad selected. <laughs> yeah, barn. Um, frequencies aren't quite secured. Know that? I've been listening to you for a while, taking notes. Very detailed notes. Okay. Keep Not looking to secure them. This is Keep operating safe zone under attack. Again, uh, okay. I guess we have to go check those yellow markers. Ready for action. Um, hang on. You are full. I'm on my way. Ready for action. Oh, you're currently scavenging. I'm gonna let it finish this. Well, actually, other people are doing it. I'm over here. Grab this pickup. Clear. This is the AK squad. Although they're not fully ammoed, and I still don't know how to force them to re-ammo themselves. Hang on. If I just tell you, come here. Oh, there we go. Maybe the problem before is wherever they were in our previous game, there was no ammo there because the difference between the HQ and the warehouse. That's what I'm starting to wonder if was the issue. Okay. So what we're going to do with this squad, with the AKs, with lots of XP. <gasps> Doorbell. Putin's here. I'll be right back. We got ourselves some food. Building clear. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, let me snooze this ad break. Boop. And then watch these guys. Excellent. Oh, yeah. Harduk, thank you so much. I hang on. I forgot to grab a fork. You're back.
There we go. No fork, only hands. That would be a messy food. I also grabbed myself a non-alcoholic beer. Is it as good as... Uh, good beer? No. Is it at least as good, if not maybe even slightly better than, you know, like a Budweiser or something? Yes. We're on the move. Or Wilson Canadian or Heineken or... Okay. Nearly one. No, I think we're good. With this guy here, we're going to go all the way over and check this site. Acknowledge. Did I? I don't think I, I think I lost the connection, didn't it? Reporting. We're going there. On my there way. Go. go, go. Meanwhile, back in the t This is a great game. This is going to be a fantastic game. Mm -hmm. Oh, so cheesy. So cheesy. Mm. And perfect arrival time, too, because the stream is just ending. A classic Saturday. Quill has not. Nope. Quill has not eaten anything yet today. Very typical of me. <laughs> mm -hmm. So four o'clock in the afternoon. I'm pretty hungry. We got some workers available. So. Let's throw them in here, because we do have some grain. Yeah, good. Get that going on. We've got some meat as well, so those meals are happening. So in theory, food production's coming up okay. I don't think we have the Putin technology yet, unfortunately. Although there. speaking of technology, we have some. Someone had asked about greenhouses. Oh, yeah, see, we can do our farming research to increase our crop yield, which seems like an excellent idea. A couple people off scavenging. Throw them back into research. I think the slow research was fine. I think a small building for research was an excellent decision. I would still like more fencing. All question of priorities. Our tool factory is about to come up. Maybe I built the tool factory too early. Six. Signals weak. Still have to go into it. Oh my god. Ready for action. I guess, yeah, you can finish scavenging this building. building repurposed. Get into the vehicle. Ready for action. Did you? Is there nothing to loot in here? Hmm. Okay. So the next signal. Is. Where's this yellow arrow pointing me? Oh. Up over here. I know they're going to be out at night, but I think that's probably fine. We've got all of our other squads over here. On my way. Okay, the squad that's about to move out, maybe what I'll do is I'll tell you. Stay here. Going there. Operator. You're there, which is good. Ready for action. There, okay. Oh. That was quick. Sir. The signal is slightly stronger over here. If we search the nearby buildings, we might find the source of the transmit. Okay. Understood. Watch yourself. Operator, on my You head over there. Reporting. You're okay, heading into this building, and the other one that's walking. I think you're heading out. We're on the move. Go on to the way. HQ. Board eliminated. So yeah, it's probably a little dicey. To have one squad exploring. Oh, we found where the transmission was coming from. There's been one in safe zone. Seems it fell years ago, but the equipment somehow survived and kept transmitting. It's powered by solar panels or occasionally catching light. Maybe we could try using solar energy too. All right, let's try. Okay, I mean solar power does sound pretty good. Receiving. You may as well finish scavenging the building while you're here. Oh, there's another vehicle, too. It's a long walk to go and collect this one. Yeah, I wonder if there's any way to put a squad in a vehicle. Like, why can't we put a squad in the back of the pickup truck? Have one squad drive it out? Or can you split a squad when you're somewhere? Maximum number of squads. Maybe that's a thing. Okay, I think someone might have brought it out. Split the squad and grab it. Yeah, so drive a whole squad out, then split it. So we'll, that's what we'll do with this squad when it's there. We will have to disband one of these. We'll wait for the uh, the horde phase to end. Clear. They're breaking into our building. They're gone. Horde spotted. Our building is under attack. I'm gonna say I think they're gonna. Well, we can bait them a little here. There we go. They're gone. 
operators. Roger. We've got them. The door Order won't eliminated. close much longer. Um, hop out. Bait them. There we go. Hop back in. Infection clear. Okay. You two. Oops. You two go and clear that building. You disband. I'll disband you as well. We're going to come back over to this squad. Split you. Uh. Okay. You'll go and do this vehicle. Excellent. Uh. Go and do this so we can grab some tech. Operator, this is big. In one of the houses, we killed two extremely fierce infected. Once they were down, we noticed that there was a child in there. A living, infected child. Must have been no older than three. It ran on all fours like an animal and jumped into the sewers before we could get it. For the love of God, if they can multiply. Things are getting worse. Everything is terrible. Yeah, we'll try to find it. Try to find that kid. Keep mm -hmm. it alive. I was asking about a symbol to the right of these guys. Uh, I don't know. Receiving. Ready for action. Oh, we got hostiles. Reporting. We're on the move. Just get in here to help cover. Excellent. All right. Go and loot that. You, I mean, our food situation's gotten better. I'm a little leery about using some vehicles, but I might get you guys to just go and loot a few of these buildings over here for extra just foodstuffs. But otherwise, the barn is going. We have some idlers. No building to be done right now. Resources, yeah. See, if I want to build, we've got lots of bricks. I don't know what we're going to use all these bricks for. I'm wondering if we should go back to just tree chopping. Winter's coming again. Of course it is. Of course it is. Alright, you can come home. You're pretty loaded with stuff. You've recovered in the new vehicle. Kind of feels like maybe you should scavenge. Although you're you're an empty you're half empty squad, so you know what? Go home. Because I bet you scavenge at like a reduced rate as well. Waiting orders. I don't think brick wall is an option, was it? Oh, it is! Never mind. There you go. Cool. We'll use the bricks for that. Um, I think we need a couple extra gates, though. So, metal gate. Here. And then we will brick wall. Apparently not through there. There we go. Like so. You can do brick gate. Oh, I'm sorry. This can scroll. Fortified wall, fortified gate. Well, shite. So assuming these have the same range, something like this should cover everything in between. And pro uh, you've got that. You've got that. Actually, that's mostly going to cover the. No, nah, I will put one in there. So brick wall is literally just brick. Fortified wall uses a little bit of everything, but it takes a lot of material. It's pretty tough. I don't know if there's an easy way to upgrade a wall from one to the other. I think I'll just go brick wall for now. Because we don't have infinitude material. This building... Apparently, it's not count as being in the way, which is great. I don't understand what's going on here. I think there's um, a light post that was causing an issue right there. Yeah, if we do that, I got to end the stream. We got another break. It's just about to hit now, but I'm out of snoozes, so I can't do that anymore. Folks, thanks a lot. We're going to go and raid a kiss for luck. Our next live streams on Monday. What are we going to play on Monday? I don't know. Could be Baldur's Gate. That's been our Monday thing, but I'm like... Zombies? Man, we, between this and um, Last Train Home, 
We've had some nice, cool little extra bonus games here, which has been wonderful. Do, do, do. Anyway, let's rate a kiss for luck. Give her some love. I'll see you on Monday. Bye, everyone.